This episode of Comedy Bang Bang is brought to you by the Jeselnik and Rosenthal Vanity Project. Comedian Anthony Jeselnik and best friend and NFL analyst Greg Rosenthal once had an NFL podcast called The Rosenthal and Jeselnik Vanity Project. That show ended, but hope remained that they would one day return. And great news, they are back. Now part of Comedy Central's podcast network, Anthony and Greg will discuss sports, current events, and everything in between. The Rosenthal and Jeselnik Vanity Project is dead. Long live the Jeselnik and Rosenthal Vanity Project. Catch new episodes every Tuesday night wherever you listen to your podcasts. But I heard him exclaim as he drove out of sight, the juice is loose, but my five is tight. Welcome to Comedy Bang Bang. Thank you to Richie Millennium for that seasonal uh, catchphrase disorder. (laughs) 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 Welcome to Comedy Bang Bang for uh, another week, and what a week it is. This is our special holiday episode. My name is Scott Ackerman. Uh, Welcome to the show. If this is your first time listening, well, you're in for it, because this is a a special extra long episode with uh, plenty of uh, people just dropping by throughout the show and uh, cheering. Chief among them is the person who just dropped by to my left. He is uh, in a movie that just came out called... Uh, the Long Dumb Road. The Long Dumb Road. That Hooray! is it. Hooray. He did a lot of press for it. How's it doing? I want to, that's my first question. How's, how's, your, how's your movie doing? Number Wh- one movie of 2018. Holy shit. Dude. At the box office. At the box office. Yes. Even. Okay. Yep. Uh, just not in people's just, hearts? We or? just passed two billion. Amazing. Yep. Domestic. Hey. <laughs> two B D two B D D O M two B D determined. Yep. My gosh. Uh, yeah, man. Welcome, yeah, man. Jason Manzukas, to the show, hey, movie whoa, whoa, whoa. star. How are you? I am great, Jason. Pal? So good to see you. You've like got I... your holiday Morrissey sweater. I on. do. Yes, uh, his uh, wonderful face. On your wouldn't that be weird chest? if it was just his body? Like if you if if, if it was Morrissey's body, yeah, with and, no face, and your head that ended perfectly at your head, <laughs> right? Exactly. Boy, I would love that Ooh, if I had Morrissey's that Morrissey body bod? that ended perfectly at my head. Yeah, that's what I said to my trainer. I was like, I want that tight <laughs> Morrissey that tight bod. Morrissey bod, a guy who drinks beer and only <laughs> eats bread and no protein. Oh, I'm on an all bread sitch. Um, speaking of sitches, uh, welcome to this sitch. Sitches you are get stitches. Am I right? In ditches as yeah. well. Yeah, um, it's so good to see you. You're one of our great friends, and uh, I consider you to be family. Oh, wow. especially when we when we're here, we're yeah, family. Exactly, and uh, you've been a wonderful addition to the show this year. <laughs> what? <laughs> What's happening right now? I don't know. Are you having a stroke? I've, I've run out of things to talk to you about, but, I fear. For real? I yeah. mean, like, I've not seen you in weeks. We I know. Could, and I think we could have a legitimate conversation right now. We are supposed to go out to uh, eat this week I know, as well. I'm, I'm trying. I'm, I'm worried that don't, we have Don't nothing. cover too much topic. <laughs> um, all right. So d- can hopefully, you talk about anything that we're... Hopefully there's six to 18 more people who will pass through and allow <laughs> right. us to talk hopefully. to them. Can you talk about anything we won't talk about at dinner later this week? Oh, uh, probably. Probably not. I, I'm okay. saving all my greatest, uh, you know, other than uh, my movie's number one at the BO. Yep. Uh, got that BO. Mm-hmm. Yeah, yep. BO. Yep. Yeah, BO right. for BO. How's sake. that been going? Oh, not good. <laughs> not good. I just keep hosing it down. <laughs> uh, well, Jason, it's wonderful to see you. The guys, Jason, the, levels, the levels sound great. We're oh, ready to we record starting? whenever you're ready. Okay, thanks, Gina. Okay. No, wait, we have been. Okay. I yeah, thought that I, was like a vocal warm up kind of thing. You yeah, it sort of was. The first two minutes were kind of pointless. Yeah, oh, well, yeah I, I wasn't keeping track, but it's all sounded pointless from where I was sitting. <laughs> um, Gino, hello. Oh, hey, what's ha- up, Scotty? Uh, happy going? holidays happy to you. Happy holidays, Oh, Gino. Merry Christmas to Gino, you Gino, our too. intern Gino here, who uh, has been working for us for five, six years Yeah, less, so? less and less lately, but, you know, I'm, I'm still on the pay. Uh, the How's that credit internship role. going? It's going really well. I'm almost at an associate's degree That's in radio so performance at NASA. Radio Community. performance? Yes, because I'm able to focus now on performance with actual airtime. Oh, You know, yeah. so since I get all this airtime whenever I come on here because you need me to fill gaps and you got it's not 
that we need you to fill gaps here. Right? Nobody's you got, saying you got fill these gaps. weird, you know, these weird guys. You got mega stars from Long Dumb Road popping in. Although I do appreciate you coming in when you did. Thank, you for, thank you for that plug. <laughs> An immediate stop. <laughs> yeah. Well, I'm sorry about that. I just, I, you know, I just wanted to make sure you guys knew that we were recording because you guys were kind of like bullshitting around, kind of. No, we. Yeah, yeah we are recording. Yeah, so okay, that's good, fine. Yeah. That's yeah. fine. So if we put you. all this Great. out. Yeah. Okay. Thank so, you. Thank yeah, you, Gina. Thanks Excellent. so much. Excellent. And how are, how's the water situation? The, the water situation is great. I'm ready to hydrate anyone that comes in or you comes hydrate out. them. I hydrate them. I I I, I pour water okay. and then if they so, want so it, for, they drink this is it. one of those I've, situations yeah. that like because we don't have straws anymore. Is that why you have that funnel? Yeah, I have this. This funnel is for anyone who wants you know any of these because you know they, these guys. This guy's got fucking wacky characters coming in and yeah. out here all fucking well, afternoon. Uh, some oddballs. Yeah, there's some real fucking freaks. Sure. So I don't know if <laughs> someone's gonna come in with no arms or be some sort of disembodied right. head. I got to be able to pour a funnel of water. Okay, so if that person Gino, is performing a character who's who's got no limbs, you you're saying they traditionally you, no, one no one performs characters, characters on this characters, show. Yeah, no, He's saying sorry, that people with it. no limbs come. I, into I, the I show. know you're an got actor it. from the film Long Dumb Road, but you got to <laughs> understand yes, that yeah. some people aren't actors. Some people are just got real it. fucking freaks. Got and it. Scotty invites them over. I here. do have to say, Gino, that we've been getting complaints from some of our female guests that you've been pouring water on their shirts as they <laughs> enter into the building. Yes, and I, that's because um, their shirts. First of all, some of them are coming in in dry sweaters, and with you can't have that much static around equipment like this. <laughs> okay. Okay? All right. So it's much safer to be wet around this <laughs> yeah, much that's equipment. That's why I heard you say out in the lobby, we got to wet down that wool. Yeah, we got to like wet the wool, baby. Yeah, I got to wet that okay. wool. This is not a Jersey Shore situation. This is this is not the type don't, of show. Don't you is. ever fuck it. I will never go to the Jersey Shore. Oh, oh that's really? right. You're from Long Island. Because I'm from the South Shore of Long Island, Nassau County. Don't right. you ever What do you have out there? Do you have a Jersey Shore type place? Yeah, we have a fucking beach. You mean? We're a fucking island. Island, bro. I we got the whole know. South Shore. We got Jones Beach. We got Long Beach. We got Lido, Point Lookout, Ditch Which Plains, is like the best. Robin Moses. How would the anyone get there? Jones Beach Field Six. If you wanted to take the train to Jones Beach How Field Six, you, you could jump on the Long Island Railroad at Penn Station, hit Jamaica, Rockville Center, Baldwin, Freeport, Merrick, Belmore, Wanto, Seaford, Massapequa, Massapequa Park, Amityville, Copeg, Lindenhurst, and Babylon, baby. baby. Yes. But sir. you get off at Belmore and, and the train down there but that's how the rest of the train line sure, goes sure of yeah, course yeah. Yeah. yeah have you ever gone further than that did you ever uh, fall asleep and like wake up someplace that you were like just Whoa. in Connecticut? Yes, I fell asleep one time and I woke up and I was in the Montauk Lighthouse. <laughs> oh no! Yeah, did they inside? expect you to operate? I was inside. I was inside, and I, the only way I found out I was inside Lighthouse because I opened my eyes at the same time as the light passed oh, wow. me, and I thought I was dead. Oh gosh! Yeah. Oh yeah! Don't and go so into I, that light. Go, yeah, just, that bright light. And then I was fucking remiss to find out I was alive. You did, really were remiss yeah. to find out. <laughs> I was upset when yeah. I found out you I was were upset. Dead. You wanted to be dead. At that moment, I was like, "Well, I'm." Dead, it's easy. I kind of like. Did you feel a sense of relief? relief? Yeah, I was like, how long before you realized you weren't dead? It was six days. Six days. So you were. You thought the lighthouse was some sort of heaven? Yeah, and then I started to be like, this feels like a very specific pattern, and I hear, (laughs) I hear things, and the weather's changing, and I'm getting hungry. Yeah, and I thought I would be dead. So you, you went into acceptance very quickly in the dabda. Oh, you got what's the dabda? The denial, anger. Oh, the seven stages of grief. The seven seven stages of grief. I think it's high. Maybe. Yeah. I believe it's bargaining. Uh, bargaining, that's right. <laughs> Betrayal. <laughs> well, you didn't even know Dabda. So I like, you don't know I like Dabda. Dealing with grief. Oh, how, how are you feeling? Uh, I'm, I'm just be- betrayed. I'm in, by that, this. I'm in the betrayal phase. Now. I turned my back on my own grief. <laughs> I've been betrayed. But you just went through them really quickly, got right to acceptance. Like, oh, oh yeah, okay, I, just, I'm dead. I just assumed I was dead. So I was like, it'd just be easier if I'm dead now. So that makes. Easy no. on whom? On, on yourself or on your on, family? For me, for sure. I no, was like, don't feel that way during the holiday. Days. Well, once I wasn't dead, it I would have been very sad for us. Yeah, was it? No. Would it? It wasn't because we didn't I, know about any of this happening. Right, right. To be honest, I don't know when we would find out that it had happened because Gina was so infrequent here. He yeah, just, that's my that's my bad because I'm dealing with some medical issues back home. Really, so, what's oh, going no. on? Um, for I, yourself or for someone else? For myself, I have uh, like uh, constant pink sock. Uh, you know, I no, I don't. I what have, do you mean? I like, have. A, there's some problem with your laundry? What? No, it's yeah, no, it's. I wish God help me if I could just have a problem, with, another problem with my laundry. Wait, what's your <laughs> hey, first what's problem? Your first problem with the laundry. I get the dryer and the washer confused all the time and I always oh. put my clothes in the dryer first and then it just heats up all the filth that's right. on it and, and then, stinks up my whole house and then okay. you're going to school sopping wet I'm going to school sopping wet hey but no static shock baby yeah <laughs> 
Got to wet that oh, wool. Keep the wool wet, baby. But <laughs> well, what's the problem with your? Uh, oh, I have, uh, I have uh, pink sock. You pink said? sock. Yes, I have near constant pink sock, which I is don't a pro- know. I don't know. That's a is. prolapsed anus. Oh, okay. Oh, yeah. Okay. So, so due to look, some, you're saying what it looks like sticking pink, out of yeah, your. Yeah, I have rear a little tiny a, tail, and you have to keep it in a bowl of cold water so that nothing happens to it. Okay. Because like anything does it grow like one of those little sponges? Yeah, like shrinky dicks. No, I guess those are the opposite. You got to put those in the oven. If it's not in, if it's not in water and like lint gets on it, then, oh, you, then no. you're, yeah, you then don't we, want to get lint so on your pink sock. You're walking around your university sopping wet with a bowl of water and your prolapsed anus next it's to like, you. Yes. It, first of all, it's a community college. <laughs> yeah. oh, I'm funny. driving my Jeep Wrangler sitting on top of a bowl of uh, <laughs> tepid water with my pink sock in it. And then I kind Can you of, just <laughs> soak? <laughs> Can you? Yeah, can't you can't wow. you like just can you soak, soak it before you, you can go? Can you soak something your underwear or something? That, uh, yeah, I've item tried. I've with. tried everything, but it's impossible. You know, because it's like a burn now, in a way. Is you it can't, the like, kind? Is it the kind of thing like a tapeworm? Come, you lure a tapeworm out of your mouth. Yeah, or can you get a milk? tapeworm to like eat it back in? Like, I've, can, is it your body going to suck it back in at some point? One of the best ways to get it back in, I've learned, is one gentle peg. <laughs> <laughs> okay. One, one gentle peg. <laughs> Just to be pegged gently once. Okay. Oh, okay. Yeah, yeah. Couldn't you? Or you can hold a vacuum to your mouth, like a high powered vacuum. Okay. And yeah. Like a shop vac? <laughs> like a shop vac. If you put it, so you're saying you just have to get the right amount of pressure from your mouth yeah. to draw your prolapse anus back into yeah, your it, body. Yeah, it whirls it back up like so uh, you can't finishing just, a plate of pasta. You can't just finger that right back in. Oh, no, you can, but you should wear a glove and it's got to be a big finger. Did you find <laughs> Like a foam finger? Like yeah, a that Cyrus? actually helps. If you can get a glove over a New York Giants foam finger, it really gets it back in there. If it doesn't fit, you must have yeah, quit. Yeah, exactly. Dane, Dane Cook would love this. You'd be like, how about five in the pink? <laughs> you guys know this guy, Dane I, Cook? Uh, you yeah. gotta have him you on the said, show. I think you he said has been Dean Cook. Oh, yeah, yeah. And Dean I, Cook is Dane Cook's brother. Wait, is he a dean at your university? Yes. <laughs> Dean Cook. <laughs> Dean Cook, he came once when Dane was performing at Hofstra and then <laughs> stole all Dean of his material. Played at NASA. Yeah, and then he started doing, you know, shocker he's, material. He's doing a concurrent Cook act yeah. in every city that and they he did. gives college orgasms. <laughs> Well, I'm so sorry to hear about your problems, Gino. I mean, this is uh, I, it's, it's it's too fine. bad to hear at the holidays. I'm I mean, all I'm all taped up for because I'm here at work, so I wanted to make sure. All taped gonna, up? Yeah, yeah. What does that mean? You, you got to tape, tape it up. to your leg or something? No, I tapped. I, I got it back in oh. and I did a little light spackle. Oh, okay. You know, a light spackle. I sheet rocked my asshole clothes. <laughs> oh dear, okay. it's not sorry. that kind of show. No, it's oh, not. This is where in I draw fact, the line. In fact, it is. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know. You got me and Long Dumb Road over here. I think it's do that you, kind of show, baby. Now, like, do you have that kind of like ability? Do you did you ever work for a contract or anything like that? I did some contracting work out in Dix Hills. I built a home for uh, a raccoon. I think it, oh, wait, 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 I think home? Richards Hills is probably what we should yeah, say. Oh, days. no, it's, yeah. a town, it's a town in Long Island oh. called Dix Hills, D-I-X. So okay. it's oh, like but who's extreme penises. Raccoon? For a raccoon, yes. What, what uh, do you a, mean? He was a raccoon that was in a viral video and he got like a million dollar grant from YouTube <laughs> and he wanted a home. <laughs> he wanted, he wanted, he just a, wanted, home. He wanted just a home. He wanted a home. He's like a compound. Yeah. These these guys got fucking little hands. They oh, they've got them. tiny little thumbs. Yeah. It's terrifying. So, what did you build? Was it like open concept? Yeah, it was a t- it was a Cape Cod style home. Oh, yeah, nice. yeah, beautiful. With the wrap around deck, beautiful. and he insisted on an above ground pool. Oh, yeah. really? Yeah, yeah. In Long Island, you gotta you gotta differentiate because you don't can't just say pool because right. most people have above ground pools. Yeah. Right? Why is that? I've never understood. Because it's more expensive to go down, and like if you're sort of wealthy and you want to dememonstrate it, you get an above ground yeah, pool. Exactly. Yeah, exactly. Yeah, well, why like, go down when you can go up? Hey, you tell. Me, hey, <laughs> <laughs> and is I can't remember. Is your family wealthy or are they not well off? Uh, I, I know you haven't seen your father in a it in vacillates a long time. extremely. We're sometimes super wealthy and sometimes <laughs> right. very broke. Yeah. How often does that depending swing? on whom your mother is? Uh, yeah, my mom will bring you know, if she brings around like you know, one of the wealthier guys, one of the guys who owns the clock shop in town or something oh, like that, yeah. like a big, a big like a Longo's oh. watch repair. Oh, yeah, I don't know what you're speaking oh. of. <laughs> Uh, what do you guys do? You guys have uh, like uh, holiday traditions? Is oh there... yeah, we do the uh, seventy-seven fishes. Well, I don't know what's what, that. Uh, there's a, is that like loaves and fishes. The Jesus uh... well, Italians traditionally do the seven fishes on the holidays, okay. but uh, we find that you know with the amount of people that we have coming in and out on Christmas, that we should do more. So we do seventy-seven fishes. Seventy-seven. So you seven... cook seventy-seven fishes. It's I don't about... know the original seven. Oh, fishes. the original fish seven fishes is just seven different fish dishes. 
Oh, I see. Seven different fish dishes. That's hard to say. <laughs> <laughs> but hey, you aced it, my I, man. I did it, baby. <laughs> now, uh, and then now we do 77. The first 76 is shrimp cocktail. And then the last one is a- uh, is a, so The same preparation. Yes, it's just cocktail. 76 different kinds <laughs> of shrimp Is it just one yeah. shrimp in each cocktail? Uh, yeah, well, because it depends. Because some years we're making money. We'll, yeah. put, we'll put up to six shrimp in each course. Oh, oh wow. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's over 400 yeah. shrimp. And my well uncle calls it scrimp. And it's uh, fucking okay. hysterical. Yeah. But then he goes back to the home at the end of the day. It's not as funny when you, you I always forget because I'm always like, this guy's a card. Yeah. Right. And someone's like, he's actually really fucked Who up. Who is your yeah. mother seeing these days? Now she's, she's no longer seeing my uncle, her brother-in-law turned boyfriend. Right. It's very yeah, we talked yeah, about yeah, we that talked on about a preview that. show. She's yeah. kind of like on, she's on the dating scene, really. Is she? Is yeah. she on uh, the internet? Like yeah, Nash.com? Yeah. 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 Is she yeah. on like Tinder? Or? She's on White Widow. What's White that? Widow. Uh, it's an app for white women whose husbands are dead. To yeah, okay, <laughs> okay. <laughs> that's uh, that's and, like and very men, specific. Men seeking them. <laughs> men seeking white widows or women seeking white widows. Hey, sure, it's 2018. Yeah, sure. Everyone's fucking. All right, Gino. <laughs> so great to see you. Hey, it's good to see everyone here. I'm not going to talk anymore after this. I'm just going to pour water <laughs> no, for the no, guests no, and please, stuff like that. Uh, talk all you like. We do have to get to our other guests. Oh, thank God. Uh, this is he's a seasonal favorite himself. He's been on the show many times. Uh, I met him, I believe. Well, I mean, I believe I met him when I was a little boy. But uh, oh, no, you didn't. No, was that <laughs> yeah, on the naughty list? No. Well, you we didn't meet. Do you remember how my whole thing goes? <laughs> yeah, but I swear I came wandering down the stairs at one point and I saw you over there by the milk and cookies. It, Santa Claus is here. Yeah. <laughs> oh, Merry Christmas. Thank you so much. Yeah. everyone, Christmas. including you. It, oh, wow. All right, well, Santa. Should, should make you feel nice. I included you. Well, thank you. Hello, I Gino. Hello, Hi, Jason. Santa. Hello, Santa. Thank Merry you for Christmas. coming. Merry Christmas Great to, to see you, too. Yes. Gino, I haven't been to your house in quite some time. Yeah, my mom, the clock guy was a Jew, so he oh. kind of Oh, okay. Yeah, yeah. I meant more because you're naughty. <laughs> oh, yeah, oh, that too. I'm a, Did you think? Why would I bother? I don't go to the naughty house and just like walk around. In just the living case room the place like a real creep. Oh, uh, well then. That, what am I, James Elroy? There's still reindeer hooves. <laughs> oh, 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 that's a deep cut. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, that's you, for the you Elroy think, heads and the, that's right. you think, the Elroy L's. <laughs> you think you're hearing reindeer? reindeer there are reindeer hoof prints on the roof of my house, so I thought. Why for sure are you was, up there? I gotta be. <laughs> So you got to keep an eye on these fucking neighbors of mine. You on Christmas? <laughs> Even especially at Christmas. Yeah. You're up there on the roof in the middle of, of a Long Island winter? Click, yeah, click, you, click. <laughs> you got to keep an eye on these motherfuckers. They'll, yeah. they'll attack the second. That's when they want you. They'll yeah, attack. Like, hey, what do you yeah. think? This is a purge situation? I don't fucking know. You got to see these neighbors of mine. They're fucking I guess wild. everyone knows so. that I haven't, are... I haven't been to that neighborhood in decades. Oh, wow. You don't make those naughty. stops on the. Uh, so it's why a, bother? It's a naughty Asapequa. neighborhood. <laughs> it's yeah. Let's just say it's a naughty neighborhood. <laughs> um, well, uh, Santa, so good to see you. Thank you for dropping by our Christmas show. Thanks, Scott. It's a pleasure to be here. I mean, I got nothing else going on this time of year. Well, wow. I appreciate it. It's a week before Christmas. Get a load of this guy. Gets on the phone. <laughs> begs me to be here. Please, Santa. Please. Twas the week before Christmas, and uh, all throughout this episode, you're being. <laughs> You're a wonderful addition, much like Jason. <laughs> Great poem. Wow. <laughs> um, you are grasping. <laughs> what is going on with you these days, Santa? I no, mean, but, you we, know, we haven't seen you in a couple of years, I it's, think. It's been a while. It's been a while. Oh, <laughs> interesting. <laughs> He's caught up on all the inside jokes, though. <laughs> it's been quite some time since I've been here. Uh, and, you know, I, I've just been... I, I haven't been around because I've been throwing myself into my work the last couple Oh, of years. sure. Well, you do a great job every well, year. thank you. No complaints so far. Can I ask you, <laughs> Except just for like, those, some kids do complain. Do kids have, I don't like has that. technology changed how you do your job now? Yeah, do you have to are, put together phones now? Like, are you getting as many proper letters or? I don't get as many handwritten letters as I used to. Do you just get tweets? I get a lot of tweets. Why did I open that account? <laughs> you know, I was lurking for a while, and that was fun. I would sure. just like see just what people Just checking said. out what yeah. people were mentioning exactly. about you? Exactly. You haven't, you haven't been shadow banned yet? No. <laughs> you know what? <laughs> Let me say something about that. Yeah, please do. Wait, can you I explain feel, what it is? I f shadow banning is when Jack at Twitter decides that uh, he's not going to promote your tweets or, or they're not going to be seen. You're not going to be searchable. I see. Yes, okay. you're not going to be searchable. And I have a lot to say about Christmas and how it should be. Oh, okay. Well, hit us. Well, what, let's start with songs. There's a lot of songs that need to go. Okay. okay. Yeah. Jingle Bells. Rudolph the Red-Nosed Reindeer. Jingle Bells is fine as an instrumental. Oh, okay. You know what needs to hear the lyrics. The lyrics are garbage. 
The lyrics are absolute garbage. I, f- I feel like Jingle Bells needs to be preserved just as a quote that you can put in other Christmas songs. So like a, you know, any Christmas song. You jazz it up song, at the yeah. end, and then yes. it's like, oh, the song's over. And they're like, oh, I'm going to throw ding, in a little quote from yeah. Jingle ding, Bells. Ding, ding, exactly. Ding, 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 yeah, everyone ding, knows ding, how it goes. What the ding, fuck are you doing? I'm yeah. just saying like at the end of a song. Yeah. I, I think I got it. <laughs> Why are you looking at me and singing ding, ding, ding? <laughs> Who am I supposed to be looking at while I sing ding, You're ding, You're not ding. supposed to be singing at all. You, could, you could be looking at his wife. Oh, okay. Oh. You could be well, looking at his wife. All right. I don't know. I don't know. No one's even looked <laughs> at me. Excuse me, ma'am. We're, we're taping no a show. No one's Hold even on looked at me since I answered and sat down, and no one's acknowledged me. I and, think I just, some... and I actually just think that the elf in the room needs to be addressed. Here's what I wanted. The elf in the room? It's the elf in the room. <laughs> That's the saying we have. Oh, it's the saying you have. The elf in the room. The elf in the room needs to be addressed. On the shelf, I say put it somewhere fun. Do something fun with it, <laughs> ma'am. Explain yourself. Who are you? I, 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 let me, please allow me, Scott. Uh, look, I mean, look based look on the, the outfit, I can look guess. at the ring. This is my wife. Are you, Mrs. You're Claus. trying to mansplain your wife? <laughs> I'm, yeah, to you. <laughs> I've got a ring on my finger. That's right, I'm honey. Read the claws. <laughs> That's right. My name is Sue Claus. This is Sue Claus, my, my new Sue wife. Claus. Big new Sue wife. Claus. Yeah. Big new Sue wife. Claws. Wait a minute, Big Sue. Whoa. How long you didn't recognize you with this diamond on my finger? Wait, do you know so each other? Yeah, it's so I, I've glittering. actually been around here before. Also, your hair is all white now. Yeah, and yeah. You, you have little was... granny glasses on now. <laughs> An unfortunate yeah, side yeah. effect of marrying this fat <laughs> fuck. <laughs> 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 you got me. The second we got married, was, my hair was like, you're a thousand. I it's know, over. I know. Oh, my gosh. Nobody, no men are looking at me. You, got, you didn't even acknowledge me. It's, I, it's true. I, I've lost all my fucking, you know. Fuckability. I'll, I'll, fuckability. Be, I'll be honest. Uh, I disagree. When I, when I, same here. I'm, I'm, with, I'm with Mr. Claus on I this. Think. When I met oh, Big okay. Sue, I was like, you okay, Gino, that'll do. <laughs> Wait, let him talk. It's going to be a compliment. I was just going to say, when I met Big Sue a few years ago, I thought she was one of the most sexually compelling people yes. I'd ever Met. Absolutely. Well. And upon her introduction today, I thought, "Who's the old lady in the room?" Yeah. You know what's Thank funny? You. I thought she was close to being the most sexually compelling person yeah. I ever met. And then after we got married, guess what? She is. Yeah. <laughs> ding 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 ding. ding, ding, ding. Stop, so stop it. Deep on stop the dick. it. <laughs> what? I beg your pardon. What? <laughs> what's that other? I didn't say. <laughs> Big, Big Sue, <laughs> let's remind everyone who you are. You are a. Uh, oh, my wife. I'm I, curious if you still are employed at the rug shop. I go like, oh, here's what's exciting. So, we've done a mashup. I'm now doing my own business with Claws, claws and Claws Businesses. That's right. Claws I, and Claws Businesses. Business, uh, it's our business uh, LLC. Yeah, that's right. And <laughs> we're going to go public <laughs> very soon. If you want to invest wow, in claws. you guys are doing an IPO <laughs> if you want to for Claws and Claws yeah. and LLC well, Businesses. Carpet Drugs down there. Has been acquired. That's okay. right. And I'm going to be selling a line of ho- silly holiday carpets yeah. coming live. <laughs> so people can have ugly holiday carpet parties. Okay. And yes, it's going to be hysterical. So <laughs> carpet seems like a very, like, it's one thing to put a sweater on and off, like, no, like Scott's. Well, how about, how about when it matches the drapes? Now, I'll yeah. have you look here on my website. Check, oh. check this out. Pull type, it up. Type, type, type. Oh, what do you now, check? Microsoft <laughs> Surface. I like that you are both <laughs> doing typing while saying typing. I She's got me doing it now. When I type anything, type, I say type, 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 type out loud. So we're turning into each other. It's, 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 look at my stomach. I mean, I'm, I'm just gone so backwards. No, thank you. Speak, please, please, please look at it. Please, please, please put your I have a little belly button please, ring. Please put it's your shirt troll, back down. I got a troll belly please pierce. Your, you have two <laughs> belly buttons. Just a fat little pin. One's not that. Oh. What? <laughs> One is not Then that. pull your shirt down farther or your pants yeah. up. I'm yeah, not sure. Hey, hey, you're talking to my let's wife. Let's connect those two. <laughs> Santa, defend me. I'm trying, honey. I'm trying. These creeps. <laughs> Why do I feel in the first hour, the creep hour? This is wild. I, I didn't want this kind of treatment. But let me just tell you. So we started the company. Well, the company's gotten a, it's a spinoff company. It's a, it's a branch spin-off. out. It's, a, it's under closet, closet business. Absolutely. Yeah. So, of course, we're going to have a whole line of funny carpets. Yeah. Carpets that say things such as... Look up. Uh, carpets that say things such as, you thought my carpet was shag. Look up. You know, so it's kind of a yeah, very... Are all of these I'm look sen- up I'm themed sensing, carpets? I'm yeah. sensing look up is... is a, look up is the punchline to most of the and carpets. And then up. upon looking up... The skirt. What happens? You show, it's a lady should be standing there in a skirt. It's when you're having a party. Yeah. And she sees it and, and she, she goes, looks up. You thought this carpet was shag. No, no, no. Look she, up. No, no, no. No, she, the, the lady's standing on the carpet. Oh, my God. How is this so hard to understand? Really? The lady stands on the carpet. 
carpet. <laughs> Other people, people see the lady standing on the carpet. They read the legend on the carpet that ends with "Look up." Okay. Then they oh, look the up key. the woman's yeah. skirt. Oh, so they yeah. then get onto the floor and they must look be, up her skirt. They must be well, reading it they while do? laying so the, on the floor. The directive. It's very small print. Look, it's very what is hard to understand about oh this? You my fucking idiots! Gosh. How many okay, of these are you selling? Let me give you a scenario. How many are you selling? I don't want to get into numbers. Was it Shark Tank? I don't want to get into numbers. I want to tell you something. When you're at a party and you're getting and everyone's getting real fucking crazy and everyone's drinking as well. Losing People end up mind. laying on the floor. Hey, you're yeah. telling me. We start laying on the, the floor. Car- Thank you. And they People, end up reading they end the carpet. reading the carpet. Of course, we have another t- another rug that's a twist of game, just yeah. built in. Okay. Um, comes it's with, look up. Comes with an elf. <laughs> it's the game. Comes, comes, with, comes, comes with, with an elf. elf. Yeah. He's a breakdancing elf. You spin him on the thing, and okay. he tells you where to land. Oh, I see. <laughs> and then he looks up your dress. <laughs> and he <laughs> goes, <laughs> Wait a minute. I, is, is, so this, is, the is this elf alive? Or is this elf a motorized? He does have a name. His name is Ho Ho. He's very unemployed. Oh, wait, wait. Met this you're elf. just trying to get give away Ho Ho. Look, if someone buys the rug, Ho Ho comes with it. I don't know who's gonna buy it. The rug is four thousand dollars. We oh, have. Boy. Oh my god, you broke the whole system here. <laughs> Plug it back in. Ooh, it feels good. <laughs> so Stick you're the land in. Is Ho Ho Ho's not here? Is no, he's not. Uh, God, I sure. hope not. No, he's not. Okay. God, I hope you, this is plenty of people. <laughs> so now, so oh. here's what you do. Yeah. You have one of these carpet parties, right? Ugly carpet party. Yeah. And uh, you, if you're hosting it, all you have to do is just move all the furniture out of your house. It sounds like someone so much, brings so everyone much work. brings over. Move all I'm of not the furniture. Finished, asshole. I'm sorry. Do you like cleaning or do you like rolling up? I'm going to come back to this. Exactly. Here's the thing, Scott and I do do a Shark Tank like program. Yes. Right. Where we so we'll will... tell you, it's Mr. Wonderful. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, you're going to get this. What does that you? mean? <laughs> if you interpret tongue flicking as eating you out, you got another thing. I'm coming. Herkovic for sure because I love dogs and kids, and I'll try any stupid. Yeah, ride you know you can be part of this. I'm like yeah, a yeah. Barbara Corcoran type. I, I think. agree. Yeah. So this, our show is called Dolphin Bowl, and we just kind of like. <laughs> Have, have people good, on good and dolphin yeah. bowl. All right, well, we don't really need yeah. to sell it to you because it's a very successful business. Is it? so great. Have you even sold one? Have we? Have even we even sold, sold one? one? <laughs> That's not an answer. Santa. What a fucking question, Santa. <laughs> Yeah. You answer that. It's too stupid. So to your question is, have we even sold one? Have you even have sold, you sold one? Oh, he's asking it again. No, How condescending. No. How condescending. So condescending. Be? Oh, my God. I'm sorry you have to witness this, honey. It's bad. I'm going to put on blindfold. Answer the question. So the question is, have we even sold one? Yes. Have you even I'm sold out. one? We I'm are, out. We are. Gino's out. I'm out. What is this? What is this? This is Dolphin, Dolphin Bowl. Bowl. Dolphin Bowl? <laughs> All right. I don't know what that means. It's because I put a little sticker of, the, of a dolphin on the ball. I'm and they're not. gentle. They're very gentle. Dolphins. Ha- these three. What are your profits? What are your profits margin? What are your profits margins? Or your yes. profit margins? Or is it margins? profit margins? I'm sorry, I'm a I'm creative. I'm not sure how one pluralizes. I'm sorry, I'm sorry, we're creatives. We're not business people. And we don't need you around, okay? We got to figure it out. Also, Sounds like you you talk, business you're people. talking to the wrong guy. I make a bunch of shit and give it away for free. I was going to say, you are primarily known in, yeah, for working a in the business. Right. So, not for profit. So can I make some fucking money for what? No. Jesus Christ. Have you made any? You've changed. Okay, so what was your question? Can you have you sold have you even, even one? Have we can sold even one? Can you it in a more optimistic way. Yeah, exactly. How, how many of these uh, fun novelty rugs have you sold? We're about to sell a bunch. As we're on the verge. You're on the tip. It's, a, it's, a, it's we're very building, cool. building, building, building. Yeah. So, so, so we're word of mouth. Yes. This is part of it. Yes. Were you yes. two we're right now tell us as we approach the end of the fiscal year. That's right. And, and the calendar year. How, how have Both you done? And the meta the same, same to you? And the metafiscal year. <laughs> And my birth calendar, which is a one month calendar. What is right. that? And mean? the advent calendar. What do you We're mean almost a birth well. calendar? <laughs> I celebrate my birth once a month, every month. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Sue what, has Sue has a little for? she has a little birth calendar that changes on the wall. You open a little door, and it's it's the thirty or thirty one or sometimes twenty eight or twenty nine days of Sue. But let oh. me say, I had to do this because when I married you, and That's don't right. start getting defensive, <laughs> I aged so rapidly. I wanted to figure it out. Could I do a calendar that made up That's for right. it? So I have a special calendar for my magical aging. Yeah. Now, I what I try to tell her is, yes, you do look a lot older. Personally, I like it. He's <laughs> but very into old bitches. You, you are immortal now, so that's not bad. Right. It's you good. look almost exactly like his previous wife. And you know what they say? You know what's interesting? But we don't, uh, we don't like when to talk don't about like my her. previous she wife. She passed. We don't care. When I she passed? She, away, passed? Well, she, she can't did, have passed. She did She's pass. immortal. Some of us care more than others. She but. passed the road sign on her way to hell. I don't care. <laughs> okay. Oh, my oh, come God. On. Let me tell you something. Sue. Have you heard my new laugh? I guess I haven't unless yeah, you've yeah. done it already. Well, none of you said anything funny yet. This oh, yeah, no, so, this is not a funny show. This is so good. It's about well, Long Dumb Road. Where do you hear this? Where do you hear this? <laughs> right. Can you do the commentary I'm track? I'm so proud of her. <laughs> oh! 
Ho! Oh, oh, Ho! Right? I'm crying with laughter. <laughs> oh, God. <laughs> you, you literally are. Oh, my yeah. gosh. I'm crying. Oh. Well, uh, Mrs. When you, Claus. On the third ho, a moth came out of your mouth. You <laughs> yeah. know oh, that, right? good. That Finally. Magical? I've been trying to get rid of that. Also, you see my tears are individual snowflakes, each unique, one different than the last. Do you have any special powers? Yep. Watch this. Whoa! <laughs> a full she candy gotcha. cane. <laughs> she got you. She a gotcha. full candy cane. We're crazy it about feels her. Good. We love each other. We love each other so much. We I, love each I other love so this much. man. He's the most generous man I've ever met. Like, what attracts you, uh, you to that, him? What, every, year, he, every year he gives gifts to kids for nothing. Yeah. As I'm long a great as they, guy. All they, all they do is be good. Can I ask a question, Santa? Do you have sure. Do you have children from your first marriage? And how do they feel about you getting married so quick? I can't so believe quick? you're going to bring this up. This is the kind of show. Well, didn't our publicist give the, you a list of yeah, topics? This is not the greatest Wait, did you write a book? Discussion. Uh, no, your publishers? A, a, a publicist. Oh, I'm sorry. We're supposed sorry. to give you a list of topics we didn't want to discuss, that being one. But okay, oh. he can go ahead and get answers. He's a grown man. You have children? I Well, I had children. Mm -hmm. Had? Had? Yes. Oh, wait, are they... Passed, it, passed away. No, they're adults. No, oh. they have they have disowned me. They've disowned, They've disowned you. you. They, they're not happy with my new life, mm -hmm. even though it's the same as it's been. I just have a new same as it ever was. He always sings. Same as it ever was. <laughs> uh, this is my beautiful wife. <laughs> and hello. <laughs> <laughs> so, I mean, are they upset that your 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 previous wife passed away? Is that they are upset that I remarried so quickly? How, wait, how, wait, how quick was, was it? Wait, my yeah. first wife was not quite dead, but the marriage was dead for years. The marriage had been dead for come years. Come on. So you you were like, can I be happy? Come on. Can you have a little life? I can't have a little life. And how did you meet? We had a <laughs> we met at a friend's house. Oh wow! Mutual friend? Or? Yeah, mutual friend. Who, I what hate friend? him though. But I, he's a friend. More of a friend of me for yeah, sure. Yeah, absolutely. Whose but house? Who? Uh, anyone we know? Or? Yeah, you know him. You know him. I mean, everyone knows him. Everyone he's does. He's the most famous reindeer of all. Oh. <laughs> Ray Ru Rudolph. Dancer? The red nose, yeah. Dancer? No, I, know, <laughs> I will tell him you said that, though, because it's fucking hysterical. You will hate don't, that. Don't, don't, please. That I, makes, I can't that makes things I can't hard for me. You I'm didn't texting laugh him. at it. No, no. That makes things, no, don't. Ho, ho, I'm texting him. You said it off. I can't be mad with you. Ho, ho, ho. That's fucking hysterical. Sue, where do you know Rudolph? from <laughs> from, every, well, from my childhood first of all he yeah. landed on my roof went clip clop all night fucking long my That's dad right. went fucking ape shit shot the shit out of his leg no one even tells yeah. you only a three that was a weird year we lost Rudolph for uh, for a good week and a half we didn't know <laughs> really? where he was a lost week and a half yeah he, he didn't get back he was inside my chimney he, he was, tried to get in to get revenge was, they're not Rudolph's, supposed to go in there I know they're right? not supposed week. to his go antlers in. wouldn't even fit he's yeah. moron he's not smart <laughs> of course we hung out for but you guys still hang out with him the nose is the brightest thing about him you didn't hear that from me I hate him but he's hysterical but I, I hate him but he's, <laughs> he's all right he's not so bad he he's sometimes just, does funny shit what do you mean well he does funny shit like he's oh, funny oh okay like a clown <laughs> like monopoly <laughs> like he's a clown funny yeah and then you like just monopoly. saw you we just saw games. each other and love bloomed the two of us i was struck two, by who her do you right think we're away. talking about <laughs> i was struck by her right away she was eating a pizza oh well, yes I, I was housing whole, it i lifted it up she folded was in half, going folded in half again the whole thing did not cut into in triangles quarters. bit the bit the triangle part opened it up put my face through yeah like one of those <laughs> those cats and bread in, on instagram and i yep. wanted to be a meme because i was i was really struggling yeah. with my business and i was trying to become a meme and get really mo get really money so i she wanted, to get, really she wanted to get really money <laughs> just in my bank account be really money yeah. right at the time it was really empty Mm -hmm. yeah. And memes are a good way to do that. And I'm not the gold digger, but I did find a great guy. Yeah, but you guys <laughs> uh, have right. no money. You're not selling anything. You're not, he just gives and, everything and it sounds away. Sounds like you're wait, taking wait, wait, wait. Santa into what a, a sidetrack. You've sidetracked him away from his main I'm business. I'm sorry. I don't understand what the fuck. I don't understand hey, how you don't get. Let me tell you something. Can we I'm live? Thousands of years old. No one makes me do anything I don't want to do. Okay. okay. Cool. All right. There's like, no Santa like, curse. Like see your, fucking Santa Claus. Like see your kids. He's not Why Tim Allen. Okay. Okay. Nobody makes you see your. Do kids. you want to leave? You know what, Jason? Do you want to leave? I think you're gonna get some coal Should up your go? fucking ass. Should we go? Should we leave? <laughs> no, guys, no, please stay. Don't, please don't let stay. them ruin this for us. Okay, we are here to promote our business. Okay. Carpet rugs down there. Call one nine nine nine. Carpet rugs down there. <laughs> Call one nine nine nine. Carpet rugs. Oh, this is humiliating Santa. for you, Santa. Why is Santa, it? What? Also, you're, isn't you're, that like a twenty-five digit phone number? And it, yeah. And it costs twenty-five we're, cents a minute. We're at the North Pole, idiot. Yeah. <laughs> 
Coal one. Oh, so you enough. relocated coal there a lot? The whole well, rug store's been relocated we deliver to deliver on coal? Christmas Eve. Yeah, well, that's only. where we live. We, you deliver on Christmas, Christmas Eve only. Eve only. Well, it's, when the, it's, when the, it's when we're out and about. You were that's free right. shipping. Free that's shipping. Right. Free shipping. Right free down shipping. your chimney. And if you don't have a chimney, rugs? come to your front door. We'll have for your door right. right. sign for Free shipping for rugs is wild. It's a good price. Very heavy item. We can do it. Well, if Does it come in a very small box? A surprisingly small box? It's the size of a mini fridge. Lisa Matt. Size, yeah. yeah. <laughs> All when right. Well, you know, I mean, uh, I'll plan ahead. If I need a rug this year, I'll just plan ahead to get it next year. I suppose. Why a, no, a novelty yeah, you, rug you, for you your rug. You could get it now. You could get it this year. Okay. Christmas. All right. Uh, get, next holiday party. How much are these things? Four thousand dollars. Okay, no, 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 I'm out. I'm out. Do you have any synthetic well. rugs? Something with no, we already, something with no lint or fuzz on it. Yes, we do. And we already You're very concerned about static electricity. Oh yeah. Well, well also, we do I, have the rug that says no fuzz on this rug, but look up there. <laughs> oh, all right, that's perfect. <laughs> for you. You'll be looking at your pink sock. That's perfect because I'm hairless. I'm boy. I got the boy zillion. And Scott, I'll come in. We already swiped your card, and it did go through. So thank oh, you. Oh so no. Much. Okay. Look. Thank you, Scott. Guys, we need you to take a break. Sorry. We uh, uh, have so many more guests to get to when we come back. Our special holiday episode comedy bang bang we'll be right back ho, ho, roll ho, break ho, 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 ho. someone's tickling me <laughs> hi everyone something serious to talk about here uh, everyone knows about the risks of driving drunk you could get in a crash people could get hurt people could get killed but here's some surprising statistics that not everyone knows almost 29 people in the united states die every day in alcohol-impaired vehicle crashes. That's one person every 50 minutes. And even though drunk driving fatalities have fallen by a third in the last three de decades, which is great, uh, drunk driving crashes, they still claim more than 10,000 lives each year. So that's terrible, but drunk driving can also have a big impact on your wallet. You could get arrested. You could incur huge legal expenses. You could maybe even lose your job. So what can you do to prevent drunk driving? Well, plan a safe ride home before you start drinking, designate a sober driver, or just call a taxi. If someone you know has been drinking, take their keys and arrange for them to get a sober ride home. We all know the consequences of driving drunk, but one thing is for sure, you are wrong if you think it's no big deal. Drive sober or get pulled over. <laughs> Comedy Bang Bang, we are back here. Jason Manzoukas is here. Hello. We also have intern Gino, Mr. and Mrs. Claus. <laughs> uh, Mrs. Claus, a.k.a. Big Sue. Uh, I'm eating a little chocolate, Santa. <laughs> okay. Wait, was there a comma after chocolate or? No. And as everyone else so lucky has to get to eat their boyfriend and chocolate. And by boyfriend, I mean husband. But I call my boyfriend because he's fresh. Can I tell you something? I don't often see this. It's weird. Mm -hmm. It's weird to see someone eat a little chocolate statue of you. Yeah. You're so much cuter than this. Oh, thank you. All right, stop. So you, are now you. you guys are like making out. We Please fuck stop daily. <laughs> okay. well, while we were at, while we were on break, yeah, yeah, rehydrate Santa. Please. I got it. I got it. I got it. a lot of energy. Jesus. They were going at yeah. it. Yeah. You weren't supposed to watch We're in love. Ho, ho, ho. <laughs> yeah, you weren't supposed to watch it, Chris. I'm completely tucked into my waistband at this moment. <laughs> okay. Well, we just got to, that did novelty you hear, did pencil. Did you hear my orgasm? <laughs> Yeah. We need to get to our next game. Help! Help! <laughs> oh, Jesus. Just to. You kept screaming, you shake up my snow globes. <laughs> we need to get to our next they're guest. Fake. He they're is fake. a. Uh, they are yeah. very they're fake. fake. He is they, a... have, they are trans <laughs> transparent with yeah. visible snow That's inside. Right. Look, I'm in there. All right. Go Here ahead, we go. Scott. What do you want to do? He is a uh, self described fan favorite. He has been on the show <laughs> many times. <laughs> Please welcome back to the show, my best friend, Rudy North. All right, Scott. Okay, first of all, Scott, I'm coming in extremely hot. I noticed. <laughs> I need to let you know that from Look the very jump, Oh, Scott. my God. But before we get started, I got to get this out of the way. Okay. Previously on Comedy Bank. <laughs> Uh, so I'm a dirtbag, and um, I'm from Florida, and I go quantum leaf style from job to job, taking people's identities, throat punching them, and taking their identities. If there's ever a guess. job that you like, you I, I throw punch, punch someone, them in the and then I take their job. I've gone from a leaf blower to security guard at Target, and I, the recently in the most previous canon episode, I now own a donut shop. <laughs> Are there? Do you have any adventures non canonical? Uh, yeah, there's some non canonical stuff we could get into. <laughs> sure, but, like uh, fanfic. Or? Yeah, there's some fanfic. 
Uh, but also stuff we don't talk about. I am immortal, and I do have the powers of the Flash. Oh, so um, didn't come yeah. with Santa over wow. here. Oh yeah, Wait, you have the powers it's of the not, Flash. He's immortal. Well I, mean, how, well, I mean, you get around on Christmas. Yeah, yeah. lots of I'm not running beings. all over the place. But are you going into the Speed Force like like Rudy? No, I definitely go into the Speed. Force. Oh yeah, we've yeah. all yeah. been to Speed Force. Is that you hi, Rudy. Santa? Hi, Santa. What's going on? Is this how? Is that how you get around to all the houses on Christmas? Oh uh, uh, no, that's just a coincidence. Oh, what the fuck? Of course it is. You fucking idiot. Oh, oh, sorry. Hey, Santa, really? oh, oh, right. wow. He is a fucking idiot. Wow. Santa, your aggression really rubbed <laughs> off on me. I'm trying not to be a dirtbag, but it is hard to not be one. Are you a, a dirt teenage dirtbag, baby? Yeah. Oh. I listen to Iron Maiden, baby. Oh. Are, you, are you a member of the dirtbag left? Uh, well, no, 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 not at all. The dirtbag left. I'm not even sure what the hell that is. I don't know, but hey. The, I think the I know. DBE? The, the DBL? Rudy, go on Chapo. Well, here's the thing. <laughs> <laughs> I am here because, Scott, Scott, of course, I got a new job. You did. You were working at the donut I shop got when a I new met you. job. <laughs> did, you, did you throw throat punch somebody for yeah. it? Well, Jason. Tell us what happened. Uh, well, I was walking down the street, of course. Just the other day. Just the other day. <laughs> right. Were you was, going to your lab? No, I was walking. I was working <laughs> in my lab. I was Wait, not what? working in my lab, but... <laughs> I, you know, I was walking down the street just the other day, and um, you know it's the holidays, Scott. I do is know it? that <laughs> it is the holidays. I we just saw you, a woman with snow globes for tits. Santa Claus is still next to you, fucking anti-feminist, misogynistic. Yeah, you. I am. I am pro-feminism, but I am a misogynist. Yes. Look, once I was done talking, you. I think women can do whatever they want, but I hate them. Do you Do not turn his back to me as if I was gone? <laughs> wow, Scott, this must be a hard show to host. I don't it's know. a hard show to be a guest on. <laughs> now, now, let me just say, I was walking down the street just the other day. It is the holidays, and they were selling Christmas trees on the side of the road, Scott. Goddamn right. They were, they they got there right. In Florida. You love that, right? Were, no, no, now I live in California. 10% of every tree. <laughs> My favorite type of tree. They were selling trees on the side of the road, and I said, this looks like a great job. So I said, went up to the guy. I was like, who's the tree guy? And this guy raised his hand. He said, I'm the tree guy. I walked over, throat punched him. And no, then, no warning even. No warning. I said, who's the tree guy? I said, throat punch. He raised his hand. You, you said, said throat punch. You say the words throat, throat punch. punch. It's like, kind of like. Like type, type, type? Yeah, yeah. It's like type, type, type. <laughs> I say throat punch. Then I throat punch. And then I took this guy's clothes and his identity. His, his clothes wallet. too? I didn't know that was part of oh, it. Oh, yeah. You got to take everything. You need the very specific uniform of a yeah. plaid shirt and jeans. Exactly. Do you, do you okay. give him your old clothes? Oh, yeah. He has to take my old. So now he owns a donut shop. Are you the same oh. size? He's the owner of a oh, donut shop. So he owns a donut shop? Yeah. He owns a year-round business, and you have seasonal. You're a seasonal tree yeah, seller. Yeah, because you know, look, I just really appreciated the the merriment and the joy he gives sure, people this month. Yeah, well, what this are you going to do in January? Yeah, yeah, that becomes an empty lot on like December 26th. Yeah, this is. Like, oh, should, really? You should throw punch baby New Year for Father Time. <laughs> well, that's not a bad idea. Oh, you got to start throw punching the other immortal. I, I wouldn't know. do Father Time. It's, I mean, listen, it, put it, a leash on your wife. I, was, oh, yeah, I put beg your pardon. <laughs> Look, look I, was gonna, I was gonna. I was gonna. I love it. Hold up. He likes you, to watch. I love it. Classic Have your wife cook. put a leash on me. <laughs> <laughs> I, think, I think the real question and the real concern is: Does Rudy North want to live at the North Pole? Does he want here's Santa's the thing, job? Jason, here's the thing. I, I've. I didn't want to bring this up because this is not something I did want to talk about. Hmm. But I have been having these sort of Jason Bourne style dreams where I've lived at the North Pole and maybe was <laughs> big, big root out the rest big of the big water. Big big what are you doing crouched over that coffee can? Just, Just refilling for later. <laughs> big Sue's pissing in the coffee. <laughs> <laughs> the bathroom's locked. Give her a break. Wow. Yeah, wait, I gotta piss this coffee cup and then I gotta drink it later. <laughs> That's pretty the interesting. The bathroom's locked. <laughs> so, I, wait a minute. You've been having Jason Bourne style dreams where you think yeah. you're, you've been Rudolph? I might be well, Rudolph. Is that what Rudy is short for? I don't know. Oh, it's rudimentary, Scott. Oh, but, yeah. Well, oh, your rudimentary name is Rudimentary North. North. It's rudimentary as in North. North Pole? Yeah. As as rudimentary, in, my dear. As Rudolph? North Pole. <laughs> North? Rudolph North, North Pole. North Pole. Santa, I wanted to ask you. I mean, are you my daddy? Uh, oh, oh, hold on a second. Oh, fucking what is this, God. an episode of Maury? Well, I mean, we both have the powers of the Flash, and we're both immortal. Well, now, hold on a second. We both travel in the Speed Force. That's, That's true, true. For sure. I, if you look, take a look at me, I'm not running anywhere. Wait, anytime. start over. I'm writing this all down. Okay. <laughs> right, right, right. Right, right, right. Right, right, right. right, right, right. <laughs> the achieved sketchy show. Okay. <laughs> Go ahead. So, 
right, right, right. <laughs> yes, I do use the Speed Force to deliver presents. Okay. Right. So you both have that. So we do have that in common. Uh-huh. That right, we, we right, right. Access sure. the Speed Force. Okay, okay. I do have... I've been alive for a long time, so I have a lot of kids. That's and true. you you're immortal. I've and been, you've been alive for a long I've been time. Alive Wait, you're immortal, Rudy? Yes. Yeah. Oh yeah. I told you that said you don't listen, baby. <laughs> it was all on the recap. Recap. Santa Honey, baby. Baby. It's my busy time. Oh, it's my Santa busy time. Baby. Santa baby. You say baby too? I do. <laughs> <laughs> Just quoting the song, of course. Okay, okay. please. Well, Let's hate, continue. By continue. The way, that song needs to go. <laughs> but, but baby, you love when I do it. I love when you do it. But no one else is Oh boy, here we split go. Split my legs in two for <laughs> okay. yeah, There we go. Damn, that's a dirtbag remix, man. I love that. <laughs> it's a DVR. <laughs> it's a DVR. So you're both immortal. You both have it's just, access I, to the speed force. I've been having these memories of, you know, dragging a sleigh around the world mm-hmm. as fast as I can. Right. And uh, what about your nose? Any dreams about that? Well, I did do a lot of cocaine in the eighties. <laughs> did you? Did you like? Hey, you did you the host? Club. <laughs> did you ever host? We love this stuff. Jo- yeah, join the club and show me to the bathroom. Thank you. Know you. Know hell yeah. yeah. I I said was tight as hell. But now I, I think I know co- what Speed Force is. Hell yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I don't want a fucking white Christmas motherfucker. <laughs> all, right, <laughs> all right, all right, Rudy. Sorry, sorry. sorry. Jason, were you gonna ask me? No, 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 no. That's fine. <laughs> you were gonna maybe ask me if I threw parties, Jason. Do you have parties? I have parties. I do. I do have parties. I do. I do. I used to have parties all the time. Huh. Okay. Oh, did, you, did you meet at one of my parties? Wait a second. Wait a second right now. Are you trying to tell me you are literally the person slash deer who introduced us years ago? That, I mean, you haven't seen Rudolph since. Well, no, I haven't seen him since I since he fell on my roof. Really, I, mean, I was Santa. Saying, you have magical party, powers. I didn't really see yeah. him. Did you, in a fit of peak, somehow transform Rudolph into? A human being? I mean, you know, I get mad sometimes, and I, it's a thing that I have done in the past. Or what I, if Rudy just throat punched somebody and got a different job? <laughs> Hold on a second. Oh, yeah. <laughs> did you did you throat punch a reindeer? Yes. Oh, that, now it's coming back to me. <laughs> oh, okay. I did. I was searching for the meaning of my name, wow. so I traveled to Rudimentary Door. <laughs> <laughs> I ended up at this crazy-ass castle-type place. There were some elves there. This dude, Ho-Ho. We had Sounds some fucking familiar. parties. Wow. We had some fucking parties. I'll bet you did. Oh. Oh, oh. <laughs> oh, that's nice. I She's laughing. Just thinking about it. Yeah, he says it much faster. Now, <laughs> now I did go. I, yeah, you're right. I did throw a bunch of reindeer and then take his job for a little bit. Okay, oh, that's so that's what you're saying. That okay. makes sense. Oh, and then right. my mind is wiped because I drank all that. I was drinking to do a coke. Oh, stuff. okay. So you are not Rudolph. You just no. I thought maybe I was for a little bit, but okay. uh, no, I'm not. All right. Well, that's that really explains honestly, a lot. I don't want to be your stepmommy, baby. Oh, I don't want okay, to. Okay, good. I will good, say good. that the two of you, uh, as is customary when doing comedy, bang bang, you uh, took a DNA. Test as we you did. walked in here. We did? Yeah. Yeah. Well, you Do swab- you have the results right there? Uh, that's why I, I asked you I to spit in these you, cups. You, you, oh, you swabbed my inside of my cheek with your finger. <laughs> that's right. Was that really was not amazing. part of the DNA test. Oh, okay. Sorry. That was just result. Wait, what the fuck? <laughs> I'm saying put a leash on your wife, Santa. <laughs> wow. You put his finger in my mouth. For the I'm getting out of pocket, man. <laughs> but um, I have the results no, right here if not. you'd like to. Uh, so, so wait, bad. didn't we say this isn't Maury earlier? Why did you crumple up the results? Why are you crumpling them? Hold on, before you. You, you did crumple them. them. You're Bef- uncrumpling them. Before you read the results. Now, Scott, before you read the results, Santa. Yeah. What was all the rustling? Why don't you get He's opening an He's envelope. picking it up. And you, oh, Santa, God. why do you make so much noise picking up an envelope? Here, I'll pick up an envelope right now. Did it? <laughs> Santa, I want to see some. Oh, I turned you. on the fireplace. Thank you for this roaring fire. <laughs> Santa, before Dude, you read the, the results. Was like ASMR. Before he reads the results, I want to say, no matter what that paper says, I'm going to be your son forever. <laughs> Okay, that's, and I might as well that's just in case. Haunting, Jason. I'm your son. Oh, I'd be very happy. Oh, I have both of your results as well. <laughs> so. just, okay, just so you know, you can't call being my son like it's fucking shotgun or something. Okay, okay. I want to be your son. <laughs> okay, I want to be Santa's son. No bitch. <laughs> All right. First of all, the results for uh, Jason Manzukas and intern Gino over here. Our wow. combined results. <laughs> Jason Manzukas, you are. Not the father. Oh. Someone, you know but just I like would, the little dinosaur. I would says. adopt you if you yeah. wanted. Your father, like your father. father is someone named Jason Character Wheaties. I don't know. Who no, that's no, that's different. not Jeffrey Character Wheaties. <laughs> <laughs> that's right, Jeff. He can't read. There's, he crumbled the paper so much. <laughs> Fuck you. That's how we learned, though. That's how we learned how you couldn't read. There was a crumble there. <laughs> and uh, the results: uh, Rudimentary North and Old Saint Nick. Oh, Here, that jolly old please. fat man. That's your legal name. Leave the shit out of it. <laughs> oh shit. Do you like Santa Claus, Chris? Chris Kringle or St. Nick? I like Santa Claus. 
Oh, oh yeah, Santa I would Claus. get because that's yeah. that's the Sinterklaas? most Sinterklaas. Sinterklaasen. Right, it's too creepy. That's a different guy, German Santa Claus. Oh yeah, he's not as fun. Oh, as really? Is, oh. is Black Santa a different guy too? Black Peter, you mean from uh, from Amsterdam? <laughs> yeah, I know. Yo, he's a totally different. He's a different guy. Guy. No, he's talking yeah. about Black Santa from Atlanta. <laughs> Yeah, Black Santa from Atlanta. You know about him. <laughs> All right, I met him. I met him too. This is a different the, envelope. The Rudy Let Ray Moore movie. <laughs> Here we go. Wow. Oh God. I would hate to be around when you open your bills. <laughs> Santa Claus. Wow. You are the father of Whoa. Rudy North. Wow. wow. And that's canon now. It oh, is. my gosh. There's nothing we can do about it. Oh, my I God. I feel sick. Why? Well, honey, why? I just couldn't imagine you having another child. I thought we had already counted for all Do you remember Rudy's mother two. over here? Who's my mother? It's oh. my biggest mystery. <laughs> Wait, we've never do talked we know about that? Well, do I know she, that I know she biggest... was a wizard and was born. Yeah, it's a lot, but I, do, I just don't know who she is. I Some mean, wizard if you're, back during the dawn of time? Yeah, wizard. if you're a mortal, it was probably the... Third Mrs. Claus? That was a long time she ago. She was a wizard? Oh my god, I have such a, a big shoes to fill. She, she was a wizard, a With powerful huge feet? wizard. Santa. She had gigantic feet, Santa. which I was into at the time. <laughs> was she a dirtbag You dirt swear you're too, not? Santa? I'm not anymore. Okay, I'm not anymore. as tiny as no, you know, elves' mouths. You know mouths. who ruined it for me? It was Quentin Tarantino. <laughs> he said, yeah, his feet, feet thing made it weird like, for everybody. Yeah, yeah I stopped I saw saying the N-word because of him. He ruined that for me. He likes big feet. I loved saying the N-word back in the day. He likes big feet? I want to know more. Rudy, 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 you're you know, yes. you're yeah. a, you're a grown ass man now. I mean, you're thousands of years old That's at this true. point. Do you really? I mean, this is your father right here. I just want to know about my mother. Was she a dirtbag too, Santa Claus? She kind of was. I mean, her was, name is Noel. Her name was you Noel. had a dream about her. She rings my bell. She got just gym two, class in half, half an hour. I don't know the How rest of this. <laughs> In kids and tube socks. socks. Okay, we're singing she now. She doesn't know who her son is. is. Wait. And she Do doesn't you want to be my mother, Big Sue? Damn. You have a new family now. Big Sue, yeah. you're a dirtbag too. Let her finish the song. I can't say I'm just a teenage dirtbag. Okay, we're singing. Baby. We all say baby. You all say baby. Your mother's name was Noel. Her she name was, was Noel. Second yeah. Mrs. Claus. Wait, I'm, I just she had gigantic feet and she was a wizard and a real dirtbag. <laughs> nice. And Noel is perfect, actually, for the the season. I never made that connection before. <laughs> Wow, she got her own song. Two of them. <laughs> well, Rudy, I mean, if you want wow. these people to be your parents, we'll pay for it. Please pay for, pay for it. <laughs> I mean, if the you want to go on a test? second date. Yes, oh. pay for our second date. Can let I me, go? Let me talk this over with my wife. Okay. Uh, we'll give you some space. Talk, 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 talk. talk, talk this talk. is Speed Force talk, talking, talk, Scott. Talk, 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 talk. <laughs> They're in the Speed Force. They're, they're, the speed they're force. vibrating at such an incredible frequency. They probably had a year in there. Rudy. Rudolph. Santa man. My will daddy. You, will you come live with us at the North Pole? And guide us late at night. We're drunk. Two part question. <laughs> we're got drunk in the we're speed shit faced. Force. We got drunk in the speed force. <laughs> okay, so we'll get you. Okay, okay. This okay. that's where binding. we have the North Pole Christmas we party. We need someone to guide our sleigh tonight. We have to Uber and come back and get the sleigh. It's a okay. bitch. I will do that. Oh, oh, oh hold on, Santa. One thing. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Throat punch. Oh, oh my God. God. My husband. He just uh, throat punched Santa. Oh, and he's taking he's all his taking clothes off. He's taking all his clothes. Is, <laughs> holy shit, Santa's got a hog. <laughs> hey. Gino, get your hands off it. I just want to touch it. Santa's fucking Yule hog. <laughs> Gino, Gino. Look at it. I put it on my shoulder. It's like a big fucking sack. What? Hey, he's a like Yule hog? Now, Let go. Now I see where he keeps the toys. Look at the size oh of this fucking God. sack. He's just a tree salesman now? Stop touching my ball. <laughs> wow, by the end of this episode, I will have transformed you. To Santa Claus. Who By the end, your hair is already in very like, white. In five hours, this is like the Tim Allen transformation. <laughs> oh my God! Take... Look at Santa. He's turning into yeah. just a, a regular guy with a plaid shirt <laughs> oh. and a Carhartt vest. Yeah, that, what, what sorry, it? now you sell Christmas trees. A regular guy. I've been there, done that. This fucking sucks. <laughs> oh no! Oh, his voice. Oh, Try to say ho ho ho. Ho ho ho. Oh no! <laughs> oh look, we have what to the take fuck a break. To me? This fucking sucks. We have to take a break when we. Come Come back. Uh, oh, more guests of plenty. We'll be right back with more comedy. Bang, bang. <laughs> Look, I've been in this situation many times. I need an extra burst of energy, but I don't have time to wait in line. Those two things, they seem to go hand in hand, don't they? Mm. Man, I don't have time to wait in line. But boy, I sure could use a burst of energy, an extra one, that is. 
How many times have I said that to myself or to everyone I know? Well, ask anyone that I know. They're tired of hearing it from me. Well, guess what? Here is a solution. I should just go, not what you're thinking. (laughs) No, I should just go grab an espresso monster. Of course. It sounds scary, but it really, really isn't. Espresso monster is a premium blend of smooth espresso and cream packaged in an 8.4 ounce can. Boy, that is the right amount of ounces. I've always said, why bother with nine? Nine's too much. 8.4, baby. It's just the right size and perfect for when you're on the go. Each can has three shots of espresso blended with European milk. Not American. Who needs American milk? No, European milk. Just the way the Italians do it. At 150 to 160 milligrams of caffeine per can, it is sure to give you the energy you need to conquer the day. But check this out. Espresso Monster... They don't have just one boring flavor that you're like, oh, why do I have to drink? It's delicious, but I could use at least one other flavor. Well, guess how many flavors they have? Two. (laughs) They have two delicious flavors. Espresso and cream. That's one. And vanilla espresso. So two great flavors. Produced in Denmark and the Netherlands, Espresso Monster is made with freshly brewed espresso coffee, hormone-free milk, and a unique energy blend that's compete, compete, it competes with any other drink out there on the market to have a lot of taurine and B vitamins. So other drinks don't even compete with Espresso Monster. I like to drink Espresso Monster because I'm often in this situation where just stopping by one of the coffee shops is not an option. It was delicious. And now they have two flavors. Man, I, I, two whole flavor. I could alternate every day and only drink the same flavor three times a week. That's how good this is. Close your eyes, take a sip, and enjoy Espresso Monster today. <laughs> Comedy Bang Bang, we are back. Uh, Jason uh, took off for a second. He'll be right back, but we have uh, Intergino is here. Yeah, should I dump out all these Snapple bottles full of cum? I didn't know you were doing DNA in the mouth. Like, I, I brought all this shit from You home. brought all this? Okay, look. We also have Big Sue, Mrs. Claus. Who? <gasps> oh, Who? Oh. Oh, you guys are hysterical. And Rudimentary North, or uh, the artist formerly known as Rudimentary guess, North, ho, ho, he's now ho. Santa Claus. Ho, 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 throat punch. Man. And uh, Santa, what's, do you have a regular name now? Just I don't Chris? I fucking know. <laughs> it's like, uh, call me Chris, I guess. All uh, right, Chris over here. Hey, how, uh, how high are the ceilings in here? Like uh, seven, eight feet? Yeah, they're around. We could probably fit like a six footer in here. Who am okay, I you want, you want it like, why do you want to skip? Oh, he's going right into the job. <laughs> <Wow>. <laughs> You only right have in. about a week left on this. You want a fresh cup? <laughs> yes, please. <laughs> this guy's good. We also uh, we have to get to our next guests. Uh, they uh, well, our, uh, of course, uh, we have. Uh, when I say guests, I mean guest, uh, as uh, the other uh, person probably uh, I should not introduce. Uh, he is a dramatic actor. Please welcome to the show, Peter Griffin. Uh, yeah, hi, how are you, Scott? It's me, Peter Griffin, from previously from Family Guy, but now I'm a dramatic oh, actor. <laughs> Peter, wait, Peter Griffin. Yo, okay, when I saw the name, I... This I, is I, tight. <laughs> the name sounded familiar, and now turning around and seeing the giant seeing animated him. Rhode Island <laughs> really explains... A bona fide cartoon in this motherfucker. <laughs> Yes, hi, hello, how, how's everybody? I came here from Quahog, Rhode Island. Yeah, ever been there? My wife Lois is there. <laughs> my baby oh, Stewie. My daughter Meg. You're going to name your whole family? <laughs> yep, I just forgot Chris. He's a real asshole. Don't forget yeah. the dog, too. Oh, and Brian. Brian. Yeah, yeah. Why do we Brian. know your dog? Huh? Why do we know your dog? Oh. You don't know your dog. I, well, well, yeah, you know, I'm, I'm, uh, I'm the star of a very popular sitcom. I'm and, and, it's, and it's your real family as well? That's my real family, yeah. It's, 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 it's about my real life. But here's the thing. I don't want to be that goofball anymore. Really? You, all right? Are you trying to look for some sort of Brian Cranston-like hey, segue? How, into how are you adjusted acting? to this so quickly? <laughs> <laughs> I look, crazy shit has gone down for the past nine and a half. <laughs> Half year this since is, I started doing this the show. Freaking me out. <laughs> what, you never seen a cartoon in the wild before? No. Oh, that reminds me of this time I saw President Obama taking a shit. <laughs> Oh, what? what? Wow, weird. It's a, it's almost like we should be cutting to something. His <laughs> eyes rolled back in his head as if we weren't going to be paying attention to him for the next 15 to 20 seconds. <laughs> and I'm back. Uh, oh. <laughs> Golly, that was a funny memory. I wish you guys could have seen it. Holy I laughed. 
<laughs> oh boy. Anyway, so here's the thing, Scott. All right, can I tell you? I saw A Star Is Born. Have you seen that movie? I have. Bradley Cooper. Oh my! Uh, I'm on the deep end. Yeah, it's really good. <laughs> Anyway, I saw that. And I was like, I can do that fucking thing, right? I you don't want to. Yeah. I don't want to be just a goofball actor anymore. Well, Bradley Cooper started out in The Hangover, where he was sure. a goofball. And do you remember he was also in Wedding Crashers as a I guy do, named yeah. Sack? He said, "You want a sack lunch?" That's a funny joke. <laughs> anyway, um, <laughs> I want to be a serious, dramatic actor. Okay. Okay. So well, I'm, how are you going to do this? I well, mean, you it's know, not it's, that easy. It's not that easy. But making it starts, the transition. It's, Coming on a comedy podcast is probably not the <laughs> best segue. <laughs> Listen, you got to get out there however you can, okay? So it starts with a promotional tour, right? I, okay. You know, it's like not only is it holiday season right now, but it's also for your consideration season. That's right. Your award F-Y-C. season starts F-Y-C. officially F-Y-C. on uh, January 6th with the GGs. That's right. The GGs. A lot of snubs and flubs before the GGs. Sure. That reminds me of the time I saw Geely starring Ben Affleck. Did you? Jennifer Lopez. That should have got some awards. And he's gone and again? I believe he's and gone. I'm back. <laughs> oh, wow. Well, there he is. <laughs> anyway, so yeah, um, I'm just kind of trying to do it. Uh, it's Scott, can I ask you for a favor? Yeah, sure. I'll do anything for you. Why don't you My give, new friend. Sure, sure, sure. Give me a dramatic line from a movie, and I will deliver it for you. Okay. The, probably the most dramatic line of any movie is, uh, we got to get a, a slightly bigger boat. Ah, we got to get a slightly bigger boat. Yeah. <laughs> Damn, that was that was. I mean, you I mean, said the lie for sure. Here's the yeah. thing: it's not bad until the thing you added at the end. <laughs> okay. I don't even know if you know you're doing it. What? Try huh? taking the line again. Also, okay. not positive how you could end up being in the film Jaws, seeing as that you are animated and it might stand out in a weird way. In well, these that dramas. is just Maybe animation racism. All right. Oh, well, yeah. I, I didn't even know, this. and now I got a whole Look. new category to dig in on. <laughs> Here's the thing. People don't want to see cartoon characters in normal live action movies. Yeah, you don't see like Garfield fuck cool in other world, movies. Right? Fuck Cool World. Remember Roger Rabbit? His I career do. is over, huh? Yeah. Have you seen that guy on TV recently? Yeah. It's like Scooby-Doo. He gets to be in one, two movies That's and right. then he doesn't get to do anything else. Typecast. Exactly. Yeah. So I'm here talking about breaking the stereotypes of what it means to be a comedy cartoon character in this industry. Okay. Right. The problem though, as Jason pointed out, um, is your delivery. Huh? Uh, <laughs> yeah, it's, it's it's a lot of your like nonverbal yeah. stuff that you're. It's yeah, just the like, nonverbal ticks, the sounds, and and the fact that I flash back constantly. Yeah. In the middle. <laughs> okay. I mean, that would be fine you, for you like set Citizen up a Kane. lot of cutaways. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, that's kind of my thing. Which we can't see. I think Lost had a lot of dramatic flashback. I could be Lost. That reminds me of the time I was lost in space. Okay, here we go. You want to see this one? <laughs> yeah, I want to see it. Yeah, can can we, sure. Can, can we? Yeah. Do we have that access? Can you, like, project it outward? <laughs> this is how, does, how does it work? <laughs> this is a great question. Yeah, how your, does it work? Is your mouth like I a would projector? say it doesn't work. I would say it worked it a for a couple of seasons, and now it's not really working anymore. <laughs> oh, I, I, <laughs> you got to believe, all right? <laughs> okay. Oh, like, like a, Santa? Like Santa. What a, I guess Griffin. I'm Santa now. Oh, you Santa? Sorry, I keep remembering. This fucking sucks. Sorry, Chris. <laughs> Man, I should just give it. I, whatever. Maybe you throw a bunch of me, whatever we're talking about. What a strong dialect you have, by the Thank way. Thank you. Quahog, Rhode Island. My my daughter, <laughs> Meg, my, my wife, Lois, my two you're, It's sons. almost like you're repeating those things to get yeah. you back into how you talk. <laughs> as if they are your accent touchstones. Yeah, it's almost as if you're reading stops from your hometown <laughs> train station. <laughs> All right. All right. Uh, oh. <laughs> anyway, here's the thing. I think if we all believe hard enough, we can in fact. You're locked in again. Uh, I'm locked <laughs> right in. Some might say this is the best character I've got. <laughs> Wow, his, himself is his best That's character. That's right. Also, Family Guy character is very cool and current in comedy. <laughs> what a fun impression. Anyway. It's true. What, Can you do some sort of Shakespearean monologue? Sure, perhaps? sure, sure, sure. <laughs> to be or not to be, the immortal bard. <clears throat> He's immortal, too. Okay. <laughs> so, Have you ever seen him in the Speed Force? No, man. I mean, I'm looking for Shakespeare left and right. <laughs> All right, sorry. Go ahead, To man. be or not to be. <laughs> That's the question. Whether it was, twas, fall from the lips of babes. <laughs> Or perhaps Sounding just Australian getting a beer now. with Cleveland down at the Rusty Clam. I think it's called cool. nope. Bearded Clam. Oh, that was almost Kiwi Christmas. Like, man, it was exciting. I loved the show. I'm a big fan You're of a big fan? Griffin. Yeah. Oh, my God. That Every reminds me of the time. Every single season's hysterical. <laughs> It was exciting Thank to hear you. that really famous uh, passage of Shakespeare. 
<laughs> recite it from memory. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. That was you know flawlessly. flawlessly. Thank you. <laughs> Wait, but seriously, back to what I was saying before. I think if everybody in this room believes hard enough, we can in fact all see my Peter Griffin's cutaways. Okay, all okay. right, let's try. Yeah, I'll try. It. So somebody say something, and I'll say you a thing that that reminds me of. Okay, okay, okay. okay uh, um, say okay. a thing. I'm say gonna see. Thing. Uh, I'm going to see. Uh, 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 hey, I. I, uh, I, uh, I, uh, I uh, Thinking, uh, a thing is what you need, okay. right? Yeah, I, lo- I love, Some- I love pizza. <laughs> Ooh, that's good. Uh, that's good. Uh, Thank God. Uh, uh, I love pizza. Wait, and trains? Uh, you don't have don't have to do both. <laughs> oh my God! Take whatever. Right. Take the first thing so, you heard, though. I heard trains. No. I- <laughs> You clearly heard pizza. Is my voice too high because I'm a woman and you fuckers can't hear me? Your voice is not high at all. <laughs> you know, I can't, I can't look. I uh, take my suggestion. I like pizza. What does it make you think of? All right. Well, train. You can reminds- go A to C if you want. <laughs> okay. Train reminds me of the time I ran into Donald Trump in a train bathroom. Uh, yeah. Hi. Are you using this? I got a huge dump on deck. <laughs> Oh my god, I We're saw that. It. We're We're doing doing it. It. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. <laughs> wow. Oh, it's like that scene in Hook. We did it. <laughs> So My now God. you've all seen a Peter Griffin flashback. And, so you and could so do now, that during a drama? Or, and now I'm assuming, now that we've unlocked that, yes. it's going to happen for the rest of the show. <laughs> no, all no, the time. No, right. I think it's up to us if it happens. <laughs> or are you sure? I'm positive it's up sure? to all of because us. Because if I watch that show, it happens to me a lot. <laughs> it seems Will like they all be Donald Trump related uh, as well? <laughs> Hopefully not, but you never know. Oh, my God. Yeah. Well, I so hope so, because someone needs to rescue my island from the MS-13. Uh, uh. So imagine that. Imagine being able to watch my Wait, we have ways. to imagine it now? Well, <laughs> hypothetically, when I get my dramatic but acting you're the career, one imagining things. Oh, my God, yeah. God. You know what else is imagined? My, uh, I was going to say some <laughs> stuff about my wife. <laughs> <laughs> okay, look, Peter. What is uh, Peter? What are you auditioning for stuff? Is there like is there do a Do you have an you agent that says yeah, 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 yeah. Do you have a stand at home or do you need one? Yeah. <laughs> do I have a stand at do home? Do you need help with self tapes and stuff? Yeah, I would love to do some self tapes for dramatic movies. He's, he's trying to sell, sell you a tree. He's trying, he's trying, trying to sell you a Christmas, Christmas tree. tree. Oh Chris, he's fucking good. <laughs> the big mock ups on the stands, everyone knows. Just that. That, yeah, the trees are pretty good. <laughs> Man, if I was that good at selling trees, I would have kept the damn job. <laughs> Man, anyway. What's uh, weird is that, like, what's weird is that Rudy North, now Santa Claus, is getting, like, is yeah. kind of holding hands with Big Sue. Who, who is my husband? <laughs> I don't even know. Who am I married to? But it's weird is that I believe that is his son. My uh, dick is getting yeah. bigger right now. Well, I'm not related to Santa That's Claus. That Yule hog. That's Chris, that Yule is, hog. Is, is, Chris, is this old woman your type of. Uh, I mean, your I, type? I'm not interested. Uh, would you swipe left? Or I'm swipe not interested. Left? Not interested wow, in Chris. Boy, this, is, this is terrible. <laughs> <laughs> this is horrible news. You don't even remember me, do you? You got to sign up oh, for uh, White Widow. I do. Uh, I'll never forget <laughs> you. I met my wife should Lois I, on White Widow. Should I get on White Widow? <laughs> oh, wait. We're seeing it. <laughs> oh, my wait. God. Oh, no. I, that was just a statement. That was not a <laughs> oh, oh, okay. That wasn't a flashback? No, I'm no, no. no. You sure? I'm You'll know it's a flashback when I say, that reminds me of the time that I played White Widow. Okay, okay, cool. That was I'm signing up for White Widow because I don't know if I can be with you. You're just Whoa. Well, it's like an arranged marriage. What just happened? That's true. My husband yeah. morphed into somebody else and suddenly have to be with him? What yeah. is this? But I don't get a You're not attracted to Rudy over here? Well, I'm not attracted to him. I, I mean, he is Santa's son. I don't want to jump to the conclusion. Yeah. I mean, we don't have to get married. I mean, we could just fuck. Uh, okay. <laughs> <laughs> not now, though. Okay. Right. Hey, so let me we'll ask the commercial break. <laughs> oh, my God. Hey, let me ask you. You're attracted to this guy? No, I guess. I is like it his uh, long, luxurious beard that uh, like you like so much? Hey, can, I, can I, like, uh, just see you? Uh, yeah, you I can like, show you underneath the, the beard. Throat punch! <laughs> oh, my God, a reverse throat punch! <laughs> Holy shit. <laughs> That's never happened to you. <laughs> oh, yes. fucking back, baby. They swapped clothes. That's you more fuck, like You it. never should have told me. This <laughs> <laughs> how to get back. Oh, oh my well, that, that worked out. I mean, wow. I can't believe I'm Rudy North again, but it's good to be back. Well, get used to it. Peter, we look forward to many flashbacks to come, Thank and you so good much. luck with your Happy career. Uh, you know. Choose them oh, yeah, sparingly. I hope so, yeah. For sure, for sure. All right. Uh, it's always Great. good to see you, and uh, it's. Uh, <laughs> Pow, 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 wheels. Pow, 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 wheels. Pow, 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 wheels. Look out, losers. What pow, the pow, fuck? Pow. Shit. Out What's happening? Way. Out of my way. Uh, okay. Oh, wait a minute. Beep, 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 be
Ben. Is that mic yeah. hotter than all the other mics? I thought I was coming in hot. Can I tell you something insane? What is going I can't on? hear myself at all. <laughs> it is. My ears I are You sound two, great, Ben. What are oh, those good. two events are related? Should I pull it back? Pow, pow, power wheels. Pow, 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 pow. It's Power Wheels Beth. Hello. Oh, hi, Scott. We've moved studios. I didn't know if you would ever find us again. Yeah, I've been looking for you. You didn't leave a note or nothing. Uh, sorry about that. Good for yeah. you. My mom's marketing firm also moved. I still <laughs> actually can't hear myself. Um, but, All right. Uh, Swap headphones there if you like. You know, that's our off. That's all right. I'm just moseying around a, this Don't room. be a martyr. No, no. Listen, Scott. Don't you know what time it is? Uh, party time? No, like what time of year? Oh, it's well, yeah, we uh, already it's established for your consideration time. It's the holidays. Yeah, yeah the holidays. And for your consideration, <laughs> it's the sure. biggest time for a kid because the consideration is how many dang presents am I going to get? Well, you know what, Beth? I don't know if you looked to your right, but the guy who's in charge of it is right over here, Santa Claus I, himself. I know. Well, well, well. Why don't you go That's over here? Why don't you to... sit on his lap? Well, well I never get out of my power wheels, but maybe we can like hold hands. Yeah, let me drive, up to his drive up to drive up to <laughs> That's me. what I was trying to do. Can I'll you pick up the whole <laughs> rig. You have like a Knight Rider style uh, ramp going uh, up to your left. No, I don't have a fucking ramp. Forgive my language. So are you, not, are you ADA compliant? <laughs> you, what does that mean? Santa Claus, Americans with disabilities. Yes, yes, yes. You as a person, I'm fucking Santa Claus. Hell yeah. So, uh, you know, normally. Thanks, Rudy. <laughs> I got your back, Santa. I know what it's like to be Santa, man. Beth, how Heavy are you? Crowd. Oh, I'm doing great, Santa. Scott. Merry Christmas. Merry Christmas to you, Scott. Yes, you know how normally I'm like a real pill, and I call yeah. you like a fucking loser? Yeah, it's a language that a young girl like you should not be using. But I can't because I can't get freaking fucking cold again, Scott, so I gotta be on my best behavior. Okay, yeah, please. Be on Even your... though it's so hard for me because I think I might be rotten to the core. I think you are. You're just some children are born bad, and I think you're one of them. But <sighs> Beth... You've been on. You haven't been on my nice list in quite some time. I know. Ever not... since you got these power wheels. <laughs> well, you brought them to me, Santa. I know, but you weren't supposed to become a holy goddamn terror. Well, did you know what kind of power it gives a kid to have their own mobile? <laughs> I mean, I guess I see it now. Automobile? Do you know how envious all the kids on my block are? That's why I haven't been removed from this red Jeep Power Wheels in two years. I know. Well, Your kids feet? kids yeah. aren't meant to have such independence. It's, it's kind of fucked up. It really goes to my head, but I've been trying to be good this year, Santa, so that maybe you could bring me another Power Wheels. Another well. one? Why would you want another one? Just so I could, you know, like have my own Jay Leno's garage. <laughs> wait, wait. Is that why you're wearing denim on denim? <laughs> yeah. Are there any like other my hero, Jay Leno. Are you spending any of your Tonight Show money? <laughs> okay, my hero, Jay Leno. You guys know me, Beth, an eight year old girl who lives in her Power Wheels. My hero, Jay Leno. Yeah, of course. Right. Sure, That's, sure. That makes no, sense. you're an eight year old girl, of course. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Big chin for an eight year old girl. Yeah, so do you. <laughs> <laughs> All right. <laughs> Ooh, gotcha. I'm a cartoon Dang. character. You just got roasted, my man. <laughs> Does that remind you of anything, Peter? It doesn't. It <laughs> Shut up, does it. <laughs> Hey, wait, can I tell you guys something? Yeah, I was uh, bringing my Power Wheels around because I've been looking for the new Earwolf Studios ever since they moved. And I was like, nah, maybe they're here. And you guys were all just like staring up at the ceiling with your mouths foaming a little bit. It was sort of terrifying. Yeah, we were in, yeah, we were in we a, flashback. a flashback. And then yeah. like you sort of glitch back and yeah. then glitch back again. I was yeah. like, maybe I don't want to get in here. Yeah. You don't. Oh, I thought for a second we'd, they, we'd put one of our rugs in here. Everyone looked <laughs> up. <laughs> looking up. Yeah. If only. You now, know, Beth, Beth my let's... son. Oh, I'm sorry. No, you go ahead, Cartoon Man. I was going to say that uh, my son Stewie has a power wheels. <laughs> <laughs> if you oh. ever like to, you know, ride around. Oh, yeah, what's he got? What's he got? Has he got, like, uh, what does he have? One of the motorcycles? Does he have a, a Mustang? Does he's he got have a little, a... yeah, he's got a tiny little power wheels Mustang. He'll be on the driveway being like, oh, my. <laughs> <laughs> wow. That was wow, a, just as incredible, just as flawless. <laughs> it's good that I let you go. <laughs> Back to bed. Let's talk about let's talk about how you've been this year. Do you feel that you've been naughty or nice? Um. Well, here's what I've discovered. I think my line for what naughty and nice is is a little further away than other children, and I think I've been really, really nice for me. But I may still be naughty by other people's standards. Yeah, no shit. Let's let's go through it. Have you okay. been Have you been minding your mother? Nah. <laughs> All right, off to okay. a bad start. Yeah, this is, yeah. Have, have you been doing your homework at school? Nah. I don't know if anything else needs to be said. Have you, either. Scott, that's my fucking job. Okay, right? sorry, yeah. sorry. Have you been eating your vegetables? Yeah. 
Mm. Yeah. That's There's something. One. Well, my mom started making cauliflower crust pizza, and I could barely taste the difference. Okay. Barely I don't taste know the if difference. Cauliflower <laughs> crust pizza counts as eating vegetables. That's a vegetable, I mean, Scott. A vegetable, yeah, yeah, but I mean, there the roughage isn't there anymore. Scott, They're, are you rooting against this girl well, getting Christmas? Well, I don't know. We have a bit of a history. Oh, here. I get what, it. What, what, what is it? Good body this or is something? This is an eight-year-old child. What is your history? <laughs> She's yes, Scott, are you Slim in Goodbody? Here. I am Slim Goodbody. <laughs> Wait, yes, where you, you are? I was kidding. Are you for real I throat, Slim Goodbody? I throat punch Slim Goodbody. I feel like oh, a fucking asshole. What? All right, wow. We all, we all figured this shit out. Now, Beth, why should I give you a new Power Wheels if you've been so naughty? Well, well, what about this, Santa? What about a little bit of progress? Number one, I ate that cauliflower crust. Number two... Uh, so far, I've only called Scott a fucking loser one time. <laughs> okay, but you just said it again just now. Well, but just as an example of what I could have said. Okay, but it's still not great that you said okay, it. But yeah, honestly, but it's a lot like reading back a court transcript. You're allowed to say it if it's, you know. Thanks. So you want her to get the new power Well, I mean, well, listen, I don't know. Okay, Maybe well, a the fucking fuck loser could know that. <laughs> you just said it. Hey, I'm hey, Santa Claus. Both of you shut the fuck up. Everybody shut the fuck up. <laughs> oh, the, the, the. oh. Beth, you have just a few days to get your shit together before Christmas. But let's talk about how important coal is. It's a great energy source. <laughs> clean and it's coal. clean. How about clean coal? It's, it's the clean. clean. They wipe it off. It's everything. the future. Yeah. So thank you, Beth. Nah, come on. <laughs> <laughs> I don't think so, man. Come on. I got so many years to live on this planet. What is that shit? <laughs> Beth, what do you want? You want a new Power Wheels. That's right. Anything else? Uh, well, I would like a, a fingerling and a hatchimal and some stick butts. I don't what know what the, the hell that is. Yeah, like really a fingerling, fingerling potato? potato? <laughs> oh, you guys kidding me? Fingerlings? Santa, come on, you know this. Say well, it with me. You must be sending it. It's the tiny doll, doll that you put, that on, you your put on your finger. And they're and animals, then the and you can get a you unicorn. Get a unicorn. Oh, yeah. And what, you want yes. like a Hatchimal potato? <laughs> no, you guys know Hatchimals. Santa, you know Hatchimal. <laughs> 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 guys, none of the gifts I want are it's potatoes. It's a potato that opens up and has a guys, baby inside. Guys, none of the gifts that I want are potatoes. It's a potato egg. You have no potatoes like potato on your potato list? No, it's a potato. It opens up and it goes, it squawks, it beeps, it does all sorts of things. It's not a potato, it's an egg. Beeps. It's an egg. Come on, you live in the North Pole. Please tell me you know about toys. You I tell me just that. got there. I'm new. She, yeah, she's new. She's, you gotta that's my side me. of things. We The only thing we do together is the carpet business. Yeah, they have multiple true. businesses if you buy <laughs> claws and claws business. That's right, claws and claws business. Commercial? Yeah. I, All right. What is commercial. what is the final verdict here, Santa? <laughs> Oh, come on, come on, Santa. Oh, come on, Santa. Come on. This is getting Santa. a lot more like Maury. You keep saying it's not Maury. You have to promise me okay, that between now and Christmas. Oh, it's only a couple of days. It's a, yeah, it's you like won't... seven days. Yeah, I know. I know what time <laughs> yeah, fucking who Christmas am I talking is. to? Yeah. Jesus <laughs> Christ. Open an envelope to find out whether or not she's naughty or not. Uh, I don't know. It's so loud. <laughs> okay, Santa's given me an envelope. <laughs> Jesus. He's crumbling it. All right. Beth. Yes. You are naughty. Oh, oh shit. Okay, Beth. yes, oh. but, but Scott. Here's the thing. He was saying something like I was. Well, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> That's the verdict as it stands right as now. As of now. Yeah. Okay. But and I gotta say, fair. You have, as we've established, a uh -huh. couple seven days uh -huh. to get your shit together. Okay. You gotta do your homework. Okay. You, you gotta you All of it. Gotta mind your mother. Yeah. Mind your mother, young lady. You can't call Scott a fucking idiot or a loser. Mm -hmm. Most important. And you got to eat just regular cauliflower, not just cauliflower pizza. <laughs> oh, come on. Come on. It's do you want those power wheels or not? Yes, I do. Well, then, there, you know, those are your uh, terms. All right, fine. Thank you. Can, Beth, you can do it for one week? Yeah, yeah, yeah. You one fucking week. I'm really, I'm really cutting no, some slack No, thank you, Santa. Here. Santa, you are so kind and good. That's right. Thank you so much. I'm sorry that you have to hang out with this fucking... <laughs> oh, Beth. I'm Beth. sorry. I'm sorry you have right, to I'm hang gonna... out with them fucking... Beth, don't oh, you do sorry. it. <laughs> This capable host. There we go. What if we determine that Scott about? is an actual fucking know. loser? Is she hey. allowed to call him that? Because it's not a lie anymore? <sighs> well, I if mean, he's a loser that fucks, well, then I guess okay. he's a Scott, fucking Scott loser. Scott said, hey, but then he was really like, whatever. Well, yeah, what, what, I mean, so what are the, what is the verdict over here, Santa? I mean, do we have to do like a weird Devil and Daniel Webster courtroom thing? I don't, yes, think, so. I think, I don't so. think we have time for it. Loser. I think let's do an Inherit the Wind style courtroom We don't drama. have time for this. Uh, like, right, we Beth, have, I'm going to put you back down. We have, oh, oh, God. Oh. We have to take a break. When we come back, we'll be right back with our comedy bang bang. Cue break. Hi, everyone. Have you met um, Sonos Beam? Oh, you got to meet Sonos Beam. 
It's great. You got it. Uh, you sh- I'm surprised you haven't met Sonos Beam. Oh, everyone knows Sonos Beam. It's great. You got to meet it. You got to meet it. What is Sonos Beam? Stop screwing around and just talk about Sonos Beam. Sonos Beam. Okay. So everyone has a TV. I pray to you. Otherwise, how are you watching the Comedy Bang Bang television show on Netflix? I pray you have a television. And uh, most people do. But a lot of people, they listen to the sound straight from the television speakers, which are terrible, 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 terrible speakers. You don't want to do that. Sonos Beam is the solution. It's the smart, compact, very tiny sound bar for your TV and new, uh, newest edition, not just the new edition, to the easy-to-use home sound system. Okay, so Sonos. I have Sonos at home. It's awesome. Uh, it hooks basically hooks all of your speakers up in your house to uh, an app that you just control by phone. Turn it up and down by phone. You can turn it on. You can go to Spotify. You can do whatever you want. Uh, Sonos is really awesome, and this connects to Sonos. So basically, you can watch television like I do, and you can do it all of this uh, off of this cool sound bar that sits there right next to your TV, and it sounds like theater quality sound, and it's really tiny. It's really amazing. Uh, I have a Sonos Beam during the holidays. I like to watch It's a Wonderful Life on it um, and just sit there crying about Zuzu's pedals. Those, he had those pedals in his pocket. That's how we knew he was alive and Zuzu was alive. You ever think about he's not alive when he when he goes into the alternate universe where he's not alive. He he's upset. He's more upset that Mary is an old maid than the fact that his children don't exist. He never even mentions that. Anyway, I'm getting off track, but that's the kind of thing that I like to really focus on when I listen to this Sonos Beam. Uh, Beam lets you play everything you love from music and radio. You can play the music and radio and Spotify, podcasts, whatever on the Sonos Beam in addition to it hooking up to your TV. You can use AirPlay to enjoy sound from your iPhone or iPad on Beam, all with rich sound that fills up this room. Deep bass, detailed stereo separation for music, plus crystal clear dialogue for TV and movies. All it takes is one cord to connect it to your TV. Sonos app walks you through it step-by-step. Hands-free control with built-in Alexa, and this way you can start a playlist, skip tracks, and pause simply by asking out loud. Plus, when you connect your Sonos speakers over Wi-Fi, you can put speakers in different rooms, you can listen to two things at one time, send sound from your TV everywhere so you never miss... So say you want to like, oh man, I want to go into that kitchen while my TV is going, but I can't hear it, just send it to the speakers in your kitchen. It's amazing. Go to Sonos.com to learn more and order your Sonos Beam to start your smart home sound system. That's Sonos, S-O-N-O-S dot com. (laughs) Comedy Bang Bang, we are back. I'm not going to recap who's here, but trust me, they all are. And everyone's back to their original identity. (laughs) Yep. (laughs) Yeah, yeah, we've we retconned it. I was standing up for one act of this thing. <laughs> yeah, that's that. right. So um, we are recapping. <laughs> <laughs> but I want to welcome our next guest. He is. Uh, he recently came back to the show after being gone for a while. Uh, John Lennon is back. Hello, hello John. how are you doing? Uh, speaking of immortal, hello, welcome. <laughs> Thank you very much. <laughs> Thanks for having me. Sorry I was late. Yeah. Well, no problem. Where were you though? I was I was taking uh, a lost weekend. No, no, I don't do that anymore. Oh, okay. I was taking gifts down to the children's uh, shelter. The, the oh. children's children's <laughs> shelter. Yeah, you were taking gifts down. It right? was yeah. I was taking it down to Saint Catherine's uh, School for Disadvantaged Children and, wow. uh, and ugly children. Oh, and ugly and children. Ugly. Just tack like, that on. So the some end. of the ugly children have it made, but is that like ugly. a smaller building out back? That's just not the same. No, it's all a small building. Oh, it's all the small right. building is right in the front. But they have the advantages that the disadvantaged children don't have. Right, but they're uh, just ugly. Other than their looks, right? Right, and uh, it's a dang very. It. So if I wasn't this adorable, I could get more gifts. From John Lennon, yeah. I yeah. mean, what, well, type of, what type of gifts are we talking about? Well, I do want to say I lost most of them on the way there. So <laughs> you I, did. I didn't deliver. It. How did you lose them? I had them in a sack. Santa okay. Claus, you know, you understand. Oh sure. yeah, Santa does oh, the same I, This guy's got a girl. fucking sack on him. Trust me, we saw. <laughs> okay, him. don't make Gino. him talk about that, please. Now that's interesting to me. Why would you not want Santa to talk about his sack? 
<laughs> to me, it's um, as normal as it's I don't my know. own personal playground. <laughs> it's private. Interesting. It's we haven't met private. before. <laughs> private. You guys are playing with each other the entire show. <laughs> you, 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 oh, oh wait, God. you, you should see what it's like at home. Yeah, I was gonna say you're a prude oh. at this point. Here's a prude. Hi, Mr. Lennon. <laughs> Love your song. Thank you very which, much. Which one? Simply <laughs> having the wonderful Christmas, Christmas time. That's Paul McCartney. <laughs> I don't give a fuck. <laughs> Either do I. He did so this is Christmas and what right, have you done? I don't like that one. Right, yeah. No, was, I didn't like that one as much as the other one you just said. That one's too, too emotional. You like Paul's cry. better. I like Paul better, yeah. Yeah. Than me. <laughs> do you Paul, wish you Paul is your favorite Beatle? He's my favorite Beatle. He's not he's not my favorite friend. No, Ringo, of course, is your favorite right, friend. Well, yeah. Why Ringo. is Ringo not your favorite Beatle as well as your favorite friend? Oh, it's complicated, but it mostly comes down to, you know, musicianship. <laughs> Does Ringo know this? I tell him on most days. <laughs> what a good friend. <laughs> you do want someone who keeps you honest. Why aren't you talking to Paul all that much if you love him so much? I can't get him on the phone. Oh, he's very busy. Yeah, he's yeah. an email guy and I don't do email. <laughs> yeah. I, I don't do it well. What do you think of his plastic surgery? Makes him look really young, doesn't it? Uh, I think, yeah, it makes him look younger than his sons. <laughs> How has he kept his beautiful brown hair for such a long time? Yeah, can I tell you, uh, can I tell you something? Yeah, please. That's a clump of dirt. What? It's not hair. No, is he bald as a bee? It never was hair. He always had dirt on his head. You're kidding me. All is a what? It's always just <laughs> been. So th does this remind you of the time you found out it was dirt on his head? Does what remind you? <laughs> We're just trying to see I was, if we're I was fall into to a listen. flashback. <laughs> I was. <laughs> Oh, oh that, is that matter. what's happening on this show today? Yeah. This, show, <laughs> this, show, this show has built-in flashbacks. If, Good. To answer your question, yeah. in quotes, yes. Yeah. Gino, how are you? I'm wonderful, Johnny. Good, Good to see you, God, bud. Yeah, I'm sorry about the, the uh, Kramp, uh, Krampus DVD you lent me. Uh, yeah, I know. I, what I, happened to I it? I snapped it in half. <laughs> Why? Because I, I watched a bit of it. Adam Scott is in that. I, I, good, good for him. <laughs> <laughs> but I was watching it, and I opened it up. It was too scary. I snapped it in half. Re you didn't even put it into the DVD player? No, I did. I did. Oh, okay. Yeah, sorry, I skipped that part. You, slept, <laughs> you snapped the DVD player in half? <laughs> no, the DVD player is fine. Okay, it's thank so, God. Oh, okay. And you still got to be give honest, back my DVD player. Okay. Yeah. Uh, that was not part of the I don't know that was part of the deal. <laughs> lent you a DVD player and Krampus on DVD because you had said you never seen Krampus. Right. So I gave you my TV and I gave you a DVD. You said, I don't have a DVD player. Right. So I give you my DVD player. Right. But the deal was for the DVD <laughs> itself. <laughs> and I, thought the, I thought the DVD player was just, you know, you being nice. This is like a one way gift to the Magi. <laughs> <laughs> if you don't have a well, DVD player anymore, why did I loan you my copy of Jack Frost on DVD? Yeah. And if well, you I loaned thought, him your copy of Jack Frost on DVD, DVD, why did you ask for the jacket to Jack Frost that you lent me back recently? Is and that you your jacket? Lent, I don't know. <laughs> Is that <laughs> your jacket? Is that your jacket? Because I put it somewhere else. <laughs> Man, so I'm lost as hell, man. Not, not me. You're, You're not the only no, one. I get it. You, yeah. You're he's one of the few. I get this. <laughs> You're locked in. I get this stuff. Break it down for us, John. Did, Sing a song about which, it. Which Jack Frost, by the way, Jace? Was it the horror the movie or the Snow, Michael Keaton? Snow Dad is better than oh, No Dad. Yeah, that's dear. right. That's yeah. Michael, Michael Keaton. Keaton. Great movie. Did you snap it in half, Jace? I love, I love that movie. Movie. Great performance. Great performance. Wonderful in movie music. Very early on. Very early on. There's a scene where there's a bad playing. There's this one guy that just really just jumped really out pops. Me. Yeah, <laughs> He pops. Cool. So now, John, you were telling me uh, when you called me up and asked if you could be on the show. Right. You said I, that I had to beg you. You said that you had uh, <laughs> you were going to bring you were going to get your guitar back from Ringo. Right. And you were going to play some songs and give us some holiday cheer. Yeah. I, you know, I said a lot of things on that phone message. <laughs> okay. Yeah, you did. <laughs> yeah. Primarily those things that I mentioned. Right. And, is and that, uh, you, you left a few things out. What's that? I'm very grateful for you having me on the show. Right. right. Uh, yeah, I, I didn't feel like I needed. You're to one say of the handsomest that. guys here in Hollywood. Ah, very gracious. Thank uh, you so much. You're someone who's as, the t as tall as the day is long. <laughs> yeah, about 24 hours. Right. So where's that guitar? Uh, yeah, you know, the guitar is fine. I'll have you know. Oh, good. It's right. fine. Well, break it out. And... Well, you know, it doesn't have any strings. Oh, but you got it back. I have it here. So I could I could hit on it if you oh, want. Okay. okay, but wait, Ringo broke all the strings. He he took them off. He why? Because he's a fool. <laughs> did, did you write that song about him on a hill? What? <laughs> You don't remember no. your own song? No, I don't remember any of my own songs. <laughs> Fool on a Hill comes to mind, though. Because <laughs> that is a song of yours. That is a song of mine. It's a Paul song, I think. 
I don't know. Uh, well, that, yeah, that's it. a good. That's a good question. That might be a Paul song, and, and maybe uh, it is. So and, uh, it's kind of wow. hard because they both split up the writing. <laughs> wow. we don't. But hey, look, John. Yes. So you got it back. The, I see the skeleton finger whammy bar. Right. So that's a good step. And that's a good step. And and I would love it if we did a gift exchange here and someone had strings. You're going to give it away? In no, order for no, I want now? to strings. You're going to give it away now? <laughs> you got to give it away now. Who are you? <laughs> California? If, <laughs> what you, what you you've, got, you've got to give it away. Red Hot Chili Peppers? Yeah, yeah I, I, I know. Yes. Cal. You're right. Cal who? Californication, you Cal fucking Worthington? idiot. California raisins. That guy, the sugar Beth, gang guy. What? I heard Cal that. Cal Solomon. I'm just over here Cal doing Solomon, donuts in the corner. You. Californication Solomon. He's a, you don't know him. No. Well, I know that guy. Oh, you do oh, know that guy. Oh, that poor weirdo. <laughs> oh, that poor, oh, poor He's fucked up. <laughs> um, no, I wish I did have my guitar here. I'll tell you that. You, you do. do. <laughs> I, mean, I wish I had it playing. Yeah, you, could play it. you could play I it. I wish... <laughs> What did I just say about the strings? Okay, there are no, no strings. strings on it. You know what? I have. No, some I mean it's I really. You say strings. one thing and no one listens. To I have it. some guitar strings in my trunk. Do you? Yeah, but the payment is one guitar. Okay, well I'm not. I'm not doing that. Wow. That's an actual <laughs> gift. That's an actual gift. Of the now we hit the gift of the magi. Be oh, right on the head. Yeah. Beth, if you wanted to earn some good points, some nice you points, just you could just him. give him. Uh, the, the strings. I was lying. It's just a bunch of string cheese. Beth, oh, this Beth. is oh. a real oh, hold incident. On. Hold on. <laughs> can we use this? Don't give cheese? up we yet. Can, we can still talk about this string cheese. <laughs> it, the my incident. Way. The yeah. The Wait incident vis a vis the string cheese, of course. So you didn't bring. You brought your guitar. But you have no way to play these seasonal hymns. That I, you I, do, yeah, I do not. Do you just want to sing them a cappella? <laughs> <laughs> oh, can I sing you my favorite song of the year? Yeah, please. Don't right. stop me now. Did you see Bohemian Rhapsody? <laughs> I have not. <laughs> My favorite movie of the year. Really? You said you were going to sing your favorite song of the year, and then you just sang <laughs> one line. You sang three words. Do you what? not know any of the other words to that song? Sing it, man. Some might not know the whole lyrics to that song. And, it, and are you part of some? I'm, I'm part of the big group of that who doesn't <laughs> okay, know the song. So now, uh, you love Bohemian Rap. What do you like about it? Do you I like didn't see it. I love Queen the most. I, they're the best oh, band okay. around. You were just asking if people had seen it. <laughs> right. Have you guys seen it? I did you want to know if it was... Wait, you did see it. I did not see it, but I love Queen. <laughs> <laughs> do, you, do you want a movie like that made about you? Where I get to play Freddie Mercury? <laughs> okay. <laughs> I love that. Sure. You brought I've, your got own, enough, I've got enough tank tops at home. You brought your own handlebar mustache, I noticed. <laughs> you, nailed right. the, you nailed the song. I would also like to be in that movie, Scott. I could be it as a dramatic actor. Yeah. Yep. Let's, hear, I, let's hear your take on it, Peter. <laughs> on, on Freddie Mercury? Yep. yep. All right. <clears throat> Dynamite and a laser beam. <laughs> I mean, yeah, that's, not bad. that's pretty good. That's not bad. I mean, I'm it's only as good as John. <laughs> <laughs> comparing it only to Lennon's. It's if I got the role, I'll say this. Words. If yeah. I got the role, I would give it off to Peter Griffin. Oh. <laughs> you hit so nice role. That's not how it works. I think in Hollywood, the actor you, doesn't get to give away a role yeah, to the actor. You of his get choice. I was under the impression you got to cover your shift. <laughs> At the very least, somebody's got to throw punch somebody else. <laughs> well, guys, oh. I um. <laughs> <sighs> yeah, you know, Bradley I, uh, Cooper throat punched Chris Christopherson and yeah. he got to took do his voice. <laughs> I, uh, <laughs> I, uh, <laughs> <laughs> all you gotta do is trust me. You guys, gotta listen uh, to me. I just wanna get uh, another look at you. Guys, are you, um, <sighs> are you, are you guys all feeling sleepy? I could take a nap. I've been Scott. asleep for the last 40. You are, in fact, all asleep. <laughs> what? what? For you have entered my realm, the realm of the dream lord. Uh, is this a flashback? Oh, shit. Is, is, is this a flashback? Akin to a flashback. This is the fourth reality so far. <laughs> and I predict- How is this different than a flashback? Well, <laughs> so, it's so this is a dream force. sequence? It's not the Speed Force or a flashback. No. We're not in the Speed Force. not Speed Force, nor a flashback. I hope flashback. Because we've are. got both of those active in this <laughs> is episode. Is that true? <laughs> yes. Both of those yes. convinced? Both, both of are those on the table. <laughs> both of those exist. Okay, and we're adding Dream World. <laughs> you are now in a Dream World. For I okay. am Morpheus, the Dream Lord. This oh, fucking guy. And I do not exist in the waking world. Oh, I only boy. exist in the world of dreams. Oh, and so, if you are hearing me talk. You are asleep. Is this like a Freddy Krueger scenario? Uh, yeah, sort of. Yeah, sure, <laughs> sure. You use Although, our fears against us? Well, it's actually hard for me to know because I, since I do not exist in the waking world, I never see movies as you see them. Right. I you only see, TV see shows. people I see dreaming about them. dreams of the TV shows and movies. So what do you think Freddy Krueger like, is? What are Kruger some is? of your favorite shows and movies of the year? So okay. have you seen my as dream of titty fucking Jan <laughs> I have indeed. 
Oh, all right. Oh, that's just your dream? That's not in the canon? It's not, it's not a show called Titty Fucking Gandolfini. <laughs> oh, I thought The Sopranos was just people titty fucking James Gandolfini. Is everybody having that fucking prosciutto dream? sandwich. What? what? <laughs> and I'm just drilling yes. him in between his titties. What's that show about if that's not in it? That I sort of know. ties it all together. I've is never seen it. Is there a video of that? <laughs> Man, Scott, I'm starting to think this is this kind of show. <laughs> I don't know. I want to borrow the DVD of that. Well, I don't, I don't, well, you Scott, I don't mean to make you go, yeah, to make your show go blue, but a lot of dreams <laughs> do enter into racy yeah, territory. Right. We're the, talking the about subconscious. dreams. Oh, yeah, have you yeah. met Santa Claus over here? He's uh, another dreamy. mythical. You always piece. introduce him yeah, first. We've, we've you know, met. Just because <laughs> he's the, the man in the relationship. Uh, I'm more familiar <laughs> with Sue Claus. She has more vivid Thank dreams. Thank you, it's I true. do. I don't, I very rarely dream. I dream in color and it's all red and green, baby. <laughs> Mr. Morpheus, can I ask, what does it look like when you see a cartoon character? I want to warn you now. <laughs> if you're about to head to a flashback. I wasn't yet. Okay, if you get a flashback. <laughs> but you never know. Within a dream reality, <laughs> oh, yeah. you flash to the dream of that flashback. It's like so Inception. It's, uh, Wait, this is what? A, extra this is a confusing. very good group game. <laughs> now, can I see that dry erase board? <laughs> Wait a second. But are you hey. going to change what I wrote down? No, I want to take, keep <laughs> hold track on, of all hold this. Hold on a second, Dreamy. You're saying if you... If Call me you, Morpheus, please. Yeah, okay. Come on, Dreamy. If you have a... It sounds nice when you say it. If you, you have... Like McDreamy yeah, from you're, Grey's Anatomy? Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 Uh, Grey's Anatomy, I have a lot of questions about. It's a bunch of shirtless doctors... Uh, who are humping their patients. So what do yeah, is, this, yeah. is this about That's my dream of me titty okay. fucking TR night? All right. <laughs> oh, oh, I am visiting you all and I've called you to the dream world because one of you has a troubling dream that I must help resolve. I bet it's Scott. Is it the vet? It's probably not me. It's probably Scott Ackerman. I don't know. Talk, talk, talk. Scott Ackerman, it's you. Talk, talk, talk. It's you. Interesting one. It. My I best friend. <laughs> Excellent choice, it. Morpheus. I didn't mean it. <laughs> Normal in yes. real life. Let's engage more with Scott. Yes. Character <laughs> with no <laughs> twists. You'd be surprised. He's That's fucking twist. fucked. <laughs> that is. <laughs> Your dream. Yeah, I agree. What dream? What dream? What a am dream I dreaming? is disturbing you so much that it's causing a tear in the fabric of the dreaming. And I must put your mind at ease. Is the fabric of the dreaming a blanket? <laughs> I mean, I He's guess you could poetic. use it as wow. a blanket. No, I'm and, not. He's a songwriter. You got to I mean, it's, me. it's literally made of yarn, yes? Would you, are you the blanket I'm referring to, yeah. Are you cold? No. Take some of the reality. No, I'm not you. cold. No, I'm fine. Here, have a blanket. No, I don't, don't need it. Don't be a martyr, John. No, Take the blanket. Hey, why don't you dream up some fucking guitar strings? In this dreaming, John, you could dream up some guitar strings and play them right now. Uh, Reality's yeah. fluid. Whatever you wish, you could just fashion out of the air around the spectrum? you. Um, <laughs> Scott, what is your dream? <laughs> Reality's fluid. Well, I, I, like the I could only Kinsey describe scale. the yeah. dream to you, and you must okay, tell me I'll, what it means. Okay, then I'll interpret it. Yeah. Yeah. All right. Side conversation. You're swimming. <laughs> Why not? Why right. Not? In a pool. In it's a pool. above ground. Okay, yeah. Gotta I'm, be, I might be, be in Long specific. Island, yeah. yeah. You're suffering from a terrible sunburn, and you're worried about it. You're worried that people are noticing it. You're self-conscious. Around right. you is everyone you went to high school with. Right, And you're okay. worried, do I look stupid with this sunburn? Oh, this what's is... more embarrassing than sunburn? Ringing a bell, definitely. <laughs> okay. Windburn? <laughs> Stepping, when you got that windburn? Good. Oh, that was Stepping the into the pool, you notice Bugs Bunny in a dress. <gasps> okay. Another cartoon. Another cartoon. Oh, I'm turned on. Me and too. it arouses you. That's okay. fair. It's and you're self-conscious. You're wondering, will people notice will this? Will people notice my huge, erect, throbbing I wouldn't say, I wouldn't Wait a minute. Did I say <laughs> Well, I'm dreaming. I'm dreaming. No, he was saying, will they notice? Because it's so small. I, I hope they see it. I just want to quickly dream, say, probably... also, there is no stigma to being turned on by a cartoon character. Okay? <laughs> Continue. Well, in the No stream... one's attracted to you, Peter. <laughs> Come on. <laughs> what? I'm a morbidly obese white guy from <laughs> hey, Rhode Island. Some people like guys like that. <laughs> in the stream, you are self-conscious about it. You do feel I ashamed. And okay. in the and that is the that is the crux of your of your trouble. We need to resolve that and put your mind at ease that it is okay. So I need to be proud of my attraction to attraction female to Bugs Bunny. female Bugs Bunny. Yes, okay. just to at least know that that's an option. And you it's don't, an option. But you're I, so ashamed of it is hurting the dreamscape. But I I have to confess that you know I hide that kind of thing from my wife and mm -hmm. yeah I am in my real you life. Are, you have, yeah, okay, attracted well to cartoon characters and I gotta admit Peter, Thank when you, you walked in here you know, in my green pants and my white t-shirt. 
<laughs> yeah. My wife Lois loves it. Your wife Lois is what yes. I'm talking about. I was hoping that she <laughs> oh, would. Oh, she oh. would walk in here. I thought it was here. just any cartoon character. No, like, no, male no. Male or female, yeah. dog, cat, whatever. Yeah. As soon as it's so, drawn, you're saying. That it would yes, just be exactly. If it's drawn, Anything then I am drawn? on. Could be. <laughs> yep. What about butter? Well, we have to put your mind at ease. Shut up. You're Peter. Happy. Hey, you're Peter Griffin. I can't have oh, yes. huh? You've got a question for you me. You must Peter kiss Griffin? Scott Ackerman. Oh my God. Do what? it. Do 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 it. For real. Do it. For his own good. In order for the good of the dream. Over his anxiety. Yes. I, Peter Griffin from Quahog, Rhode Island, married to Lois, father of. Don't please don't go through your whole biography. Look, I'd like to hear it. I'll cut him off when he gets to make. Sounds like Aragorn from Fellowship of the. What channel are you from? I'll what kiss him. I'll, I'll kiss him, but this is just a dream, right? We are currently in the dream. We're currently scape. in a dream. Yes. So You're not committing not... an infidelity or doing, yeah. Sure. Okay. Anyone can a... dream whatever they want to dream, yes. right? right? Yeah, there's no limits here. All here right. We go. Are I'm... pictures we take in the dreamscape postable on Tumblr? <laughs> <laughs> No Please porn. don't take any pictures. I don't want this to Tumblr get out. Tumblr says no porn, baby. Uh, that's up to <laughs> Tumblr. I only I see people's funny, dreams yeah. of Tumblr. I don't see the real Tumblr. All right, here we go. That's you ready? That's like a sad dream. That's, that's oh my sad. God. All right, I'm moving my mouth closer to Scott right, Here we go. Yeah, it doesn't have to take this yeah. long, but that's okay. Yeah. And it's just his mouth. His body's yeah. staying with it. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, their lips are moving. Oh, oh, their lips are moving. Oh, oh, they're intertwining. Oh, my God, my tongue. Oh, the children. Oh, my God. I swallowed him. <laughs> that was Your gross. passion was so great. Once unleashed, you swallowed Peter Griffin. I'm here. Peter Griffin is here. <laughs> <laughs> oh, oh, oh. Ah, I oh. knew he spit. <laughs> uh, you know, we're still going to continue to dream if that's okay, because otherwise we'll have to say goodbye to you. I might go in and out. <laughs> okay. Well, look, speaking of going in and out, let's go into a commercial and out of this show. We'll be right back with more Comedy Bang Bang. Cue break. <laughs> Comedy Bang Bang, we're back here with everyone, and uh, a couple of new people walked into the room, and uh, they are inventors, they tell me. Uh, please welcome Dennis and Dennis Croc. Hello. Hi, great to be here. Thanks for having us here. Great to be here. Yeah, great it's our pleasure. Uh, Huge opportunity for us. To, to be on the show, yes. To Definitely. be on the People. show and also to, to explain who we are, what we're doing, where we're going. Sure. Please do what, that. Do, Matt, do at least one it. of those. What we're all about, what gets us curious, what gets you curious, what how we like to receive information, how we like to give information. <laughs> that Open sounds like too much morning, to cover at this pop point. Pop out of bed, get the day going, have a little breakfast, get the energy up, and see where it heads. Slide into the afternoon, <laughs> receive all the blessings from God that helps our day go vroom, vroom, vroom into the night. You Wind down. Down after the yeah. sun goes down, okay. try to get sleepy, okay. take a couple of Tylenol PM, get into bed, say our prayers, and hope we can fall asleep for a minimum of 13 hours. Okay. So, yeah, I was going to say, you cut to the afternoon really quickly. So you're you're That's asleep the most of the day. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, yeah. Our morning is pretty much eleven forty to noon, and then boom, you slide into the afternoon. Just slide, slide, right God's in. slide right in. I'm Dennis Croc. I'm Danis Croc. Dane, Danis. <laughs> Let's spell our names for you. I think that'd be fun. Dennis, I think we all know how. Do that's it at spelled. the same nope. time. Yeah, I bet you don't. No, how I is bet it? you don't. What is it? D E A N A S. Okay. Last name Croc. You're probably familiar with it. Ray Croc. C R O C. Oh, okay. So your, your name is your name is Dennis, but it's it's, it's, it's spelled D. Is that Santa? That's Santa. <laughs> it's, it's me. It's me. Yeah, I was Santa Claus for an it's, act as well. It is really crazy. Being Do we all get to be? No. 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 no, no. no, no. no you try to throw up on him. And you know, being you married to try, someone, John being married to someone that famous is actually very difficult for me. I don't even get acknowledged. People don't even yeah, see Mrs. me. Yeah, Mrs. Claus room. is over it's here. Big whatever. Too. I don't need it. And it's probably irrelevant, but I think you're currently asleep. <laughs> <laughs> Morphe is the dream lord. That's over also happening. Oh. Yeah. Well, may or may not come into All play. of you. Pleasure to meet all of you. And my name is Danis. <laughs> right, which is spelled D A E N A S. And my last name is Croc. C R O C. What are you? What What have you invented? Crocs. Well, the Crocs. <laughs> the yeah. thick foam shoe that you slide your bare feet into. Santa loves those. It's I made love you. Santa, Santa loves those. Changed my life. Mm-hmm. Thank you. Foam. You got it. Well, if you like Crocs, you're going to love some of our new products. Okay. Uh, run, new them, products. run them down for us. Is this yeah. like another Shark Tank situation? Yeah. Or dolphin, dolphin, dolphin Ball? Dolphin Ball? No, we made so much off what Crocs, we're offering we don't need any of your money. <laughs> okay. You're 5% of our company. <laughs> <laughs> we didn't go over this, but that sounds fair. <laughs> You guys have so much money, you're giving away a chunk of it right here on We've the show. sold over 300 million pairs of Crocs. And we wow. thought, why can't we go into some other categories, right? Danis, 
That's right, Dan- Dennis. <laughs> and that's why we've so come. No here. one's Dennis anymore. <laughs> no one is Dennis. <laughs> We're seeking four billion dollars. <laughs> Whoa! To come up with some of our Santa, new products. Santa, pull out your wallet. <laughs> Hold on, I want to hear what they got first. Okay. I okay. want to watch. Now Santa. I'm in the Dolphin Bowl. How many times have you put on a shirt? And you feel like it's too floppy. Every time. It's right. too thin. It fits under other clothes. What if you had a shirt that wouldn't fit under anything else and was made from thick foam? Introducing the Kurt. Kurt. Her, hold on a the second. Kurt? I the love Kurt. This. The Kurt. I love hold on this. A second. Spell that, please. Holding on. I got a couple questions. I got a couple questions. Number one. Kurt is Kurt. a play on croc. Croc and shirt. Right, croc and shirt. It's not a play, but, I just put the brand name. Oh. But, 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 okay, honey, let me ask the question. <laughs> Please Santa. go. Oh, Santa their first is... fight. Oh, oh, my God. God. oh that's no, not true. No, fighting just riles us up. We <laughs> that's love right. It. Oh, we do yeah. on purpose. <laughs> is croc a play on something? Croc is a play on uh, croc, our last that's... name, and then right. wearing something with no socks. Yeah, Crack. You, know. you got me. Got it. Got All it. right. Now I got a question. Now this qu- this quirt that you're talking about. Now what colors did you come in? And <laughs> just I have ask noticed, both questions now. Okay, I'm going to do the best rest of it now. Now of course we talked about my tits, which are made of snow globes, and I just wanted to know what they fit under, and will people still be able to tell slash shake them? Yes. And yes. yes. To both. And okay. what colors? Yes. You can wear the quirt. Over anything, whether your tits are snow globes or regular human fleshy tits. Okay. I got a question. I'm sorry. Uh, does the Kurt come in the size that would fit a thick white cartoon man? Yeah, does it come uh, in cartoon? Two dimensional, he's asked. So it's right. wide but flat. Right, wide but flat is yeah. something that my wife Lois will love. That's the beauty of the Kurt, right? Oh, yeah. <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> All right, a simple answer to a very wow. complicated so question. So, Danis, you just agree with what <laughs> other Danis. Danis? Are you talking to Danis or are you talking I'm to Danis? Danis. I'm Dennis okay. Kratz. That's Dennis. Dennis. I'm Danis. Danis. Are, these, are these like the consistency of like a foam finger, something that you would like stick no, like into crocs. someone's it's pink like sock? Hard, just like it's crocs. like a hard Do you guys do like anything with pink right? Crocs? Oh, boy. <laughs> I would think that the the, the the croc material as a shirt would make you sweat quite a bit. Yes. Because yes. they make your feet oh, God, sweat yes. a lot. Oh, yes. So you lose weight. Morpheus, uh, Dream Lord here, I have a question. Now, I, uh, I only know crocs from what people dream of them. So I assume that the crocs have eyeballs that look at you and see the truth. When you wear Crocs, do they have eyes in them that look up at you and see the truth? And if so, will the Quirt also have eyeballs? Am I off base here? Is that the Dream Lord? Yeah, that's You're the familiar dream with me? Oh my God, we're you read early the, '90s comic books? The Dream Lord. How come you didn't know me? <laughs> Wait, quest, yes. question, who Take, do you think he is? <laughs> yeah, just looking at him. Yeah. It should be yeah. clear. It yeah. should be obvious. Mm. And listening to his voice, yeah. especially. Obviously. Oh, you gotta hear his voice. voice. Obviously Definitely. his voice. I think we can all agree it's a very accurate voice. <laughs> Maybe if you name Tell me about your, your family. family. <laughs> <laughs> then I'll be well, able to. Well, my daughter Meg, she's ugly. Uh... <laughs> My son, Stewie, he's a baby, and my other son, Chris, is a real idiot. Mm. Do you need more clues? Anyone else live in your house? (laughs) (laughs) Where are you from? Did you forget his dog again? Oh, no, my dog. My dog, Brian. I live in Quahog, Rhode Island. So you're a father. I'm a father. I'm friends with a black guy named Cleveland. Mm, and another plenty. guy in a wheelchair, I think. It's been a while since I've seen my own show. Danis yeah. and Danis, do you watch television at all? Yes. yes. Do you, <laughs> I mean, you earlier we, were talking about God. Do you watch programs that have profanity or any kind of um, we, questionable content? That's a great question. Thank you so much. Um, uh, we don't enjoy profanity ourselves, but we do listen to it. Yo, oh, wait, you don't enjoy it? But we you don't enjoy it, it or where using do you, it. Where do you listen to it? We have recorders that play it. <laughs> tape for recorders? Us. Well, not tape recorders, but taped. You mean recorders, the... Not taped recorders, like the instrument? <laughs> that are Like curse. the musical instrument taped up? And we keep dropping them, so they're all taped up. We had to cover them with tape. Right. We had how to does cover the cursing play? And that's how you listen to curses? <laughs> yeah. Okay, so I'm, so I'm having trouble hearing you guys through a thick wall of judgment right now. Okay. We're, We're just trying to figure out how to record them. Keep in mind, we are all asleep. Keep in mind, we yeah, are in a dream, a dream state. We can't be. To be fair, we might not all be even in the same realm. <laughs> yeah, yeah. I mean, I don't even know if these guys are real. We're dreaming them. Of course we're real. We're real. So the selling point of the Kurt is that... <laughs> 
it won't fit under anything. Yeah. You will not be able to fit anything above it except maybe a larger size crew. Oh wait, so you can't put it. You, oh, you, can get you a can't put anything word. on top of it. Well, what? you can get a crack it. A crack it. <laughs> honey, to honey, put on honey. Top of it. I'm having a brainstorm. Oh, I love this. Uh oh. Here we go. What if we team up with them and add them to our LLC, and we we come in as investors and we make crock based carpets for our carpets, rugs on their company. So add the crocs to Claws and Claws businesses. Absolutely. Why do All you guys right. need them though? Like, well, what sort of expertise are they adding to your like rugby? And are you going to make cra- <laughs> crap it? Well, you're going to find out in a are second, they? okay? Colombo, okay. <laughs> let me ask you Krugs. this. He discovered a crug. Could you make a crug? Could you make a carpet out of croc material? So your feet you mean slip and slide that when you sweat on it? We can make what? Carpet? It's like a wrestling Hold on a second. Man. What'd you fucking say? I said a rug. Hold on a second. Let go of him, Santa. Hold on. What'd you say to my husband? <laughs> Santa, let go of him. <laughs> Guys, Santa. Hey. Santa, no. He slapped my ass. Uh, hey, what? <laughs> did you you, you oh, motherfucker. I'm spanking her. Pull my her. skirt down, Santa. This so candy funny. ass piece of shit. We You've gone to too up. far now. We have to we wake, wake up. up. Wake up. Wake up. Ho, ho, ho. My powers are back. Oh. Oh, oh, I can crack my knuckles Fucking, again. I was uh, having a wet well, dream. Hey, guys, these guys are real. Well, hey, well you are. guys were sleeping. I stole all your real cars. <laughs> what? 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 Oh. Beth. Bad. You what? are not getting a Power Wheels this Christmas. No worries, I have a bunch of real cars now. <laughs> Can you oh. even reach the pedals? Real car, real car, car, real, oh, real, 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 real car, car. Oh, that's canon now. Wait, I got a question. <laughs> I got a question. So, is the quirk real? <laughs> is the, the what? The quirk. The quirk. The quirk. The quirk. The quirk. The quirk. It, da- Dennis. Dennis. Is that you? I'm Dennis. Oh, it's Dennis, Dennis Croc. I'm Dennis. 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 Dennis and Dennis. Now, this is interesting. This Dennis and Dennis. Sense. You keep pronouncing our brother's name, whose name is Dennis, which is D apostrophe A N U S. He hates our business, and we he hate him. Be a part of it, and he uses profanity every day. Wow. I have when a question for the name? Croc brothers. Are you guys still betting hard on Batali? Are you guys still backing him hard? Big Croc guy. Sort of famous for two things at this point: Crocs. And cookies. <laughs> what? Yes. Yes. We are a huge Batali fan. <laughs> oh, wow. Oh, no he no, actually no. helped us get our start. And no. I, I don't want to joke about him because he's close to the family. <laughs> now, I hope we're still uh, We have dream. a lot of great things. <laughs> <laughs> we have a lot of great things to say about so. Batali. Oh, boy. I don't think. <laughs> you got a lot of great things to say? A lot. A list so long, I don't even want to start Jesus. it. Yeah. Yeah. You well, can. Look. We have time. <laughs> There's I only 11 more now. guests to come. <laughs> I just noticed something. When we wo- all woke up from this dream, there's someone new sitting here in the room. What? Who, who's this guy? What's up, dude? <laughs> it's me, Big Dog. How's it going? Hey, Big, Big Dog. Big Dog. Big Dog. <laughs> We've never met before. No, dude. I just stumbled on in here with a steaming hot plate of nachos. Went to Crunch Town. You went to Crunch Town. Crunch Town. <laughs> crunch Town. I don't go to Crunch Town on nachos. I crunch them. Crunch Town. Yum, yum. I sounded down. like Crunch Town. Yeah, I did. They're no, looking I mean, pretty soggy. You've been having them for a while. Oh yeah. I keep these nachos moist and wet, <laughs> oh, and then God. I crunch them like a good wool sweater. You got to keep it moist and wet. Keep oh. the wool wet, baby. <laughs> oh baby, you guys are talking my kind of sauce. Uh, big dog, Santa Claus, North Pole. I have hey, a question. what's going on, dude? How do you? How are you able to crunch the? Nachos, if they're moist and wet, you're skilled nachos like I am. You crunch just about anything. I could crunch moist talent. I moist could... toilet? No. <laughs> Towel. Hey, come on, Towel. Gino. Come on, Gene. Some come on, people Gino. use. Hey, I Gino, that, that was uncalled for. Gino, that's the one thing you said. Gino apologized. Gino apologized to Big Dog. Apologized Big Dog. I'm sorry, Big Dog. Don't do toilet. Big Dog, don't hold no grudges. I didn't know that about wow. Big Dog. Yeah. You should. It's written right on his shirt. Are you kidding me? No. <laughs> I wasn't looking down there. I'm That's a, I'm a this, gentleman. This Look. t-shirt available in the shop in the Earwolf store. Big Dog. Oh, Big Dog don't, don't hold no hey, the to the That's crop, where I get all my Wolf Brothers. Can I, get, can I get Kirk's? Uh, Kurtz or whatever printed. Kurtz. Can I get a silk screen on the You sure can. Absolutely. Sure. Nothing sticks to thick foam better than <laughs> screen <work>. print. <laughs> well, buddy, I want to get a, a picture of a big old plate of nachos fully dressed with... Fully dressed? Fully not naked, dressed. Not naked nachos? No way, man. I want them all. What do you want? I want them sour cream. Mm. I want them guac? salsa. Guac? And you know I want some guac and yeah. you know I want some cheese. Wow. And you know I want a 
half gallon of blood. And I thought that. Hold on. Hold on. Wait, wait, wait a minute. Did, did you guys all hear that last part? That, that was the only thing on the shop on the shirt. We can have The very last thing you said I thought was unusual for Doc. Is that like a red sauce? Yeah, is that like a red sauce? Yeah, because I love a round pie with a tomato base. No, we all know that about you. Hold on. If you're in the mood for pepperoni, you could. Maybe some blood. Sure, maybe. Hold on. Hold on. I like milk. Sometimes it's cookies on the side. Our new friend, Big Dog. Big Dog. A round cookie. Leave carrots for the reindeer. Our new Does friend, the back Big, of your sweatshirt say woof woof? You know it. <laughs> oh my. Oh, it's spelled wrong. We, we have to ask you. There's a lot of things oh, written on this of shirt. Of course it is. W-U-F? I got, oh, I got eat shit on my right arm. <laughs> and who did that on my left? And these are all catchphrases? Yeah, yeah buddy, big dog. For a new yeah. character already, four to five catchphrases? Do you just throw those arms up when you're on your bicycle, depending on what the person behind you just did? Girl, you know it. <laughs> this, this is character. Dangerous. Dangerous. Complicated as hell. This is dangerous. The amount that you're adding so quickly. Yeah, trust me. You and, do and not. not too much. I love nachos. I got a couple catchphrases. <laughs> and do you always deal. wear rollerblades with triple the wheels? What? Do you always wear rollerblades with triple the wheels? If, you do it if, right you're, now. if your blades don't got twelve wheels, you're not blading right. Tell you that much right now. So it's not too much. This Jack. character is overwhelming. I like nachos. Why got are a bunch you? Of catchphrases. Why are you sprinkling jigsaw blows. puzzle? Pizzas and you've all fallen asleep. <laughs> oh, oh, that's right. That's, that's, right. that's oh, why. That's, that's, why. Why. that's why. You're that's here in a No, but he said we just fell asleep. You so that just was fell real. asleep. That was all real. Wait, that okay. was real? Just, was real? You big felt, Dog is real? Yeah, Big, big Dog is, dog is actually the most in normal the dream, person we've he, had. In the dream, Big Dog is, I will say, a large dog. And Big Dog had four <laughs> ponytails braided into each intricate little braid. You know it. You all look different in the dream world than you do in real life. Wow. Your your oh. emotional truth is now apparent. <laughs> big dog is a big dog. <laughs> Yeah. But it brought you here to a special part of the dreaming. It was oh, the God. cave of catchphrases. <laughs> oh, oh, baby, so wow. you're telling me, can I pick up a couple more? <laughs> yeah, that's right. Yeah. <laughs> We're just around. here for him? <laughs> Whatever you right. like, pluck Why them off the stalactites and the stalactites of the cave of catchphrases. Yeah, which Scott, ones do you see? Anything Scott, striking you have, your well, fancy? Do you have any room in your inventory for <laughs> yeah. one more catchphrase while so. you're here? You got anything uh, well, catching your eye? I like, uh, what's <laughs> this one? Make America Great Again. That's <laughs> oh, no, no. Sounds bad. I I totally you got, rad. It's coming from a good place. <laughs> you gotta reclaim it. Before you all wake up, I wanted to give you a little present. Here is the plate of the most perfect nachos you could ever imagine. Oh. The oh. nachos of your dreams. The nachos that, that could not Careful. exist in reality. Oh. Careful, if you bite into those, sometimes they're ironic. <laughs> bite it. Ironic nachos? I mean, crunch. Ironic nachos. Uh, <laughs> it's a little Barry Manilow. I'm a, or Soundgarden. <laughs> they were ironic. <laughs> ironic nachos. <laughs> got it. I'm gonna want to climb inside. These nachos are so dang big. Look, he's and juicy. climbing into the He's oh actually climbing inside. Oh. He's oh. swimming around in oh. his yeah. feet in those giant olives. Oh. Those nachos are dripping with blood. <laughs> big dogs in is a little dog in the nachos. <laughs> his lipsticks out. <laughs> oh my God. Right. I'm about to fuck this giant plate of nachos. All right, everyone, wake up! Everyone, wake up! Oh. Oh. He's still it. fucking the nachos. <laughs> <laughs> But he's a human. Oh, damn. Did I do that? <laughs> <laughs> okay, look, we have to take a break. We have one more guest when we come back. A, a special bit of seasonal cheer. We'll be right back with more Comedy Bang Bang after this. <laughs> Comedy Bang Bang, we are back here. Uh, Santa and Mrs. Claus oh, are here. Oh, 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 Intern Gino. Oh, 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 Yo, oh, baby. Jason Manzoukas, hey, Rudimentary North, Throw John punch. Lennon, uh, Danis and Dianus. Croc. No, yep. Deanus yep. is not here. Deanus Dennis is not Dennis. here. This is Deanus and Dennis. Dennis. Power Wheels, Beth. Pam, Pam. Uh, of course, we have uh, Peter, Peter Griffin, Griffin and... Um, <laughs> Uh, Morpheus the Dream Lord is not here, I don't think. Yeah, we, but, uh, we so don't we must know. still be. Uh, and we, Big Dog, I believe, the... has left the building. Big, Big Dog took out a shotgun and blew his head off. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> it was weird. That was <laughs> used that his right rear paw to pull the said, trigger. That was he a said, weird, was, terrible he, moment. He <laughs> said, <laughs> he said there is too much specificity to this character yeah. for it yeah, to yeah, continue. He couldn't handle the weight of his backstory. <laughs> Look at himself. That was, was very. It was very sudden and gruesome to watch. Gruesome. We cleaned up. It's been three hours. I don't know why we're still doing the show since our last segment. Yeah, we should have just gone home. We had. Counseling. Well, we have to get to our final guest, and uh, it's always our pleasure to have him on the show. Uh, and usually he comes on in the autumn times. So I'm not sure exactly when, but uh, usually when the leaves start to fall from the trees is when, when I see you. Isn't that right? 
Oh, Mr. Ackerman, it's more specific than that. It's the spookiest time of year when I come here. You usually see me around Halloween. Right. Comedy Fang Fang. Yes. You go to Suicide House and I'm there. Oh, that's right. Yeah, we didn't do one this year. Unfortunately, yes, we couldn't. Did anyone notice? (laughs) I think I heard about it a little bit. I was thankful to have been on that episode. As much as I heard about the boys not being on BCAS Black. The who? (laughs) Um... But yeah, you you called me and you said you had a new. You're a songwriter. I'm a songwriter. A songwriter so a little of bit of a backstory for everybody. <laughs> yeah, catch us up. We all need to be caught up on backstory. We should yeah, also catch you can up I, on a lot as well. Can can I, I just Rudy, say, do you want to do a previously on Comedy Bang Bang? A previously on Comedy Bang Bang. Man, okay. a lot of crazy ass people are here, and it's crazy. <laughs> Scott, uh, John Lennon, a struggling guitarist. Uh, I got a question. <laughs> struggling because you don't have strings. A well, question for who? <laughs> for question Lennon? for Scott. A question from, from Lennon? Lennon. <laughs> now that's an idea. That's, that's fun. It's as who, I've been sort of waiting around. I haven't been introduced to everyone. I'm picking up whoever it is. Who is this guy? <laughs> I, I just, uh, you're I just had, pointing. I'm getting, well, I don't. Well, Rudy North? Rudy, I, yeah, Rudy, yeah, Rudy North. North. I'm fan Please. favorite Rudy North. Um, Are we still in the previously on? <laughs> <laughs> I be still in the previously so. Look, we got to get to Leo. We got to get to Leo. Okay, I'll, then John, I'll, I'll talk to you know. after the show. We can't get into that right now, but I am immortal as well. Like Mr. <laughs> Lennon, I am a songwriter. I composed The Monster Mash in 1962, popularized by Bobby Boris Pickett that same year. However, he I'm more of a guitarist, but go ahead. He did. Yeah. However, it was not my original version of the song that became a mega hit. He made some tweaks to he it. He made as some I tweaks. The lyrics were sanitized to please the studio fat cats. And my original vision. Which studio was this at? Was this. This was Arista Records. <laughs> <laughs> Notorious for having the I think Leo is the kind of guy that does the research. Yeah, the most right. prudish record label Leo's out not there. so much a winging it kind of guy. <laughs> <laughs> Somehow this feels researched. <laughs> this is like the opposite of Big Dog. <laughs> I am sitting in his blood. This is so very unsettling. Well, sure. it was also on his nachos. Yes. So he, he eats it and he shits it out. Did we explore that at all? <laughs> Did he have no. blood on the nachos? I don't think so. We all, was, I was oh, going to ask a question about there was it. A I lot. Know, there was yeah. a lot. He I was coming in with specifics. We talked a lot Wait. about his shirt. Yeah. All right, Leo. So you, you wrote this song and then ever since then... <laughs> Occasionally, I'll see you in the autumn times, and yes. you, you say you're writing a new version of this, uh, a new song. Yeah, so I came on, I performed it the first year, the original version of the Monster Mash, right. the Monster Fuck. Right. I returned <laughs> six times from, since this is the sixth time I've been on the show this since that original sixth, appearance. This yeah. is the seventh right, appearance. Right, yeah. And each time I tell you I've written an entirely new song. And I don't, yeah, and then you sing the exact it same song. It ends up being the same monster. I, I've done that, I've pulled the wool over your eyes several times. Yeah. And, and I you apologize gotta get that for wool that. wool wet, so. Yes, yeah, so I got the wool wet, baby. Wet. Well, yeah. I have finally come up for the Christmas time, for the holiday time, I have come up with a completely new song that I'm going to debut here today. And it's not for Christmas. It's for another winter holiday. It's oh. for Hanukkah. Hanukkah. Oh. Okay. Well, we've talked a lot about Christmas and yeah, Santa I'm Claus Jewish. here. So, wait, who's Jewish? Oh, Rudy, you're Jewish? Rudy? Jewish? Rudy? Rudy? Yeah, yeah, that's it's a very Jewish. Jewish. Rudimentary right. North is I'm Jewish. I'm putting it together. Yeah, that's canon. That's canon. <laughs> so, but before okay. we get into the song, yes. and I do want to hear it. Yes. When you go on the show and you say you're going to do a new song, Right. And you do the same song you've always done. And Scott calls you on it. What is your justification <laughs> for singing He's the exact same song? He's very apologetic. Right. Well, I, I've always said it was a, at first I said it was a spiritual sequel. And then I said I was doing right. different riffs on the same subject matter. Right. Right. That had a, It was just a new sh- a, a shiny new coat of paint on the same old car. But right. it is, is it the same exact song every single time? Well, I, I, I'd argue there are some major variations. <laughs> Although I believe some kind soul layered each version on top of each other. And you do not deviate in the slightest. <laughs> I think they're different songs. I'm just, that's, I, my belief is that they are different songs. Okay, well, I'm not interested. It's it's Han- it's the holidays. It's uh, you know the end of the year. I'm not interested in a Halloween song. I'm interested no, this in. This is a, about the Festival of Light. This yes, is about exactly. the Festival of Light. Although okay. it does have you know my subject matter, my bread and butter is the spooky genre. So well, it has sure, a spooky well, Christmas element. Carol has ghosts in it. I the understand spooky that. Spooky filth yeah. genre. So this is yeah. my new song, Haunted Ka. 
Haunted they will, Car will be okay. debuting. My normal uh, backup singer, Scaroline, my granddaughter passed away. However, oh, uh, no. oh, oh, I, uh, so sorry. That's oh. a spooky reveal. Yeah. <laughs> a lot of death today. Yeah, she she passed away this past year and she is in hell now. But oh, my, my wow. grandmother. Wow. wow. How do you know that? She we can't sinned. talk about that, Scott. She committed a lot of sins. Um, but my uh, my grandson. You know sins? My grandson is here. So uh, to, to I back, love my grandpa. To back me up, I love you too, Killiam. Thank you for being here. Killiam. Hello, Killiam. Hello, Killiam. Oh, I love that I get to hang out with you. Oh. Killian, have you met Beth? You're about the same age. What? That girl over there in the corner? <laughs> I think it's I a boy. Babysit her. Is it a boy or a no, girl? No, I'm a boy. Okay. That girl in the corner doing donuts oh, in I a see. real car? That's yeah. A, <laughs> yeah. yeah, that's is, an eight-year-old girl. By the way, this is really yeah, dangerous. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Even just the it's exhaust is an issue. Yeah, just Beth, doing donuts get on in mic. It. So, Leo, you have you have a new song. This is exciting. I have I mean, a completely new song. You're one of my favorite songwriters. So He's this got is, a new song. It's a th Sorry. thank you for saying that I am one of your favorite songwriters. You that are. I mean, praise. I love the one that you've written. Well, this that, is a well that hurts me, you know. <laughs> but it's well, great. We've we talked don't about even the remember yeah. your songs. We've talked about the full on the so hill. I'm so fucking sorry, Jason. <laughs> I've lived a long life and I've been dead before. I'm sorry. Uh, John, we were once contemporaries. Time yeah, has aged me. That's true. You are frozen in time. What you are weird. ageless. I look great. What a weird so, thing to <laughs> acknowledge that is true. <laughs> John Lennon and the guy who wrote the monster match. <laughs> Roughly yeah, the man, same age. Her. You yeah, were but there, you, were really. there. you were there for that. Two artists. Of course I was. Two artists, okay? Two artists, okay? Two artists that. We were sort of racing to, to write the same song, and I just couldn't get it done. <laughs> you were you working were trying on to we were doing a, oh. a, a spook. It was called Spooky Walk. <laughs> and it was about a ghost who got legs and walked around. Oh, wow. <laughs> well, why? Why terrifying. would he need to? He can float why around. Why did I? Did have or to they, to the they can float around. So it was like a um, sort of a scary why? little mermaid. <laughs> That's right. Okay, look, Leo, we got to get to this song. We'll get to the song. And then Disney found gotta, the notebook this I was is called. In. This is called Haunted Ka. Haunted Ka. It's my spooky Hanukkah song oh. for the Festival of Lights. All right. Festival of Frights, if you will. Ooh. Oh. I was working in the lab the first Hanukkah night oh, no. when my eyes beheld an eerie sight for my monster from his slab began to rise when suddenly to my surprise his trousers dropped right to the floor with his bottom bare he ran to the door I said Frankenstein what's gotten into you he said my dick is hard and I need to screw he did the fuck he did the monster fuck. The monster fuck. It was a graveyard fuck. He did the fuck. That monster sucked and fucked. He did the fuck. He did the monster fuck part seven, haunted car. <laughs> From my laboratory, I heard quite the racket. Part seven. Deep in the castle, the vampires jacked it. Part seven. The zombies all fucked in the graveyard grass. Part seven. Wolf man wolfed down Frankenstein's ass. They did the fuck. They did the monster fuck. The monster fuck. It was a graveyard fuck. They did the fuck. Those monsters sucked and fucked. They did the fuck. They did the monster fuck. The beasts all fucked as the orgy spread. Bigfoot gave the headless horseman head. Swamp Thing jerked off in the castle moat. Thing. While Frankenstein gagged from the jizz in his throat. The fucking was wet. There was spooge like mad. Igor decided to fuck his own dad. The mummy let out. A horny moan when Medusa's bare tits turned his dick to stone. They did the fuck. They did the monster fuck. The monster fuck. It was a graveyard fuck. They did the fuck. Those monsters sucked and fucked. They did the fuck. They did the monster fuck. And Frankenstein's bride was horny as hell. The hunchback went bareback and rang her bell. She got titty fucked by a giant spider. Jizz made the streaks in her hair much whiter. She fucked every monster, come one, come all. Her three holes were filled like a bowling ball. And while skeletons boned his undead bride, Frankenstein just jacked off and cried. Now you should fuck. It's now the monster fuck. The monster fuck. And it's a graveyard the fuck. The monster fuck. Those monsters suck and they fuck. Now you should fuck. Now you can monster fuck part seven, Huntica. Wow. Oh. Thank wow. you. Oh my
right. Thank you for the applause. Thank you for the ovation. Mazel. Leo, was, mazel. Leo, can I say something? Oh, my God. Please. <laughs> That's the same fucking song you've been singing for seven years. Yeah, I felt like I knew the lyrics to this one. <laughs> Me too, but I loved it. <laughs> so I, I've never seen him sing it before. He gets quite into it. He's really into it. Super I, relaxed. It was hard to look at his face. Very casual. <laughs> I feel Very like I was watching an intimate act. <laughs> Leo, this I sort of rolled back. Leo, you you lied. Like you, you lied to me. <laughs> I don't. I don't consider it. It was a new song. It's a Hanukkah song. Hopefully that. Yeah, it all will... of the only difference was you said part seven haunted ka. Well, Killiam, you've been around. You've heard all of these songs. Uh-huh. Would you consider it new? I mean, oh, it's new every time, Grandpa. You have such great perspective. <laughs> thank you, thank Look, you to my beautiful grandma. Next- lost her old. Lost his older sister this year. He's dealing with a lot. <laughs> are, are you gonna admit that this is the same song? I. Look, <laughs> I will put my hand on this Old Testament. Oh, you brought an, you brought your own Bible. I brought an old. You brought the Jewish Bible. D- you it's, don't need this one, then. Okay, Rudy. <laughs> What's up? I, John I, Lennon has a Bible as I, well. I keep one. Well, with you me. know what? Everybody, raise your hand if you brought a Bible. Oh, okay. I, 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 everybody, I, I, yeah, everybody, yeah, everybody, everybody got brought, Bible. brought a Bible. I'm Jewish. Yeah. You're all asleep. I also <laughs> Oh, that's why we all awake. Now you're awake. You're awake. You're awake. You're awake. That makes sense. Oh, wait, wait, now we're awake. Well, that was we're back. So we can hold on. We can see Morpheus when we're asleep, right? Yeah. Yeah. Well, does yeah. the viewer just hear uh, listener? I mean, just hear nothing. <laughs> okay, John. Look, <laughs> he's confused. Yes. Leo, oh. you lied to me. I look. <laughs> I may have stretched the truth a little bit in my eagerness to get back on the program. I didn't have you on the show this year because I was so I was so disappointed in the fact that every single year you do the exact same thing. You trick me into thinking it's the same song. And then you called me up and said you had a totally new Christmas song and you did this to me. I don't know what to do now. First of all, you canceled the entire Halloween episode because of me. Yes. (laughs) It's your fault, not my fault. Wow. Uh, (laughs) Is that also why the boys aren't doing the PCAS? Yes, because of you. That's yeah. also the reason well, yeah. the because Leo Carpazzi, the old man, comes on your yes. show, not related yes. to theirs. All, any problem from this show is all because of you. I feel like I have a, I, I'm responsible for a lot. I, I apologize. You can't you know keep doing why James Adomian doesn't come on the show anymore. He didn't get enough candy. <laughs> you can't keep doing this to me. Can I? I how can I? I just I. I maintain it as a new song, but since you are you are entrenched in this position that it is the same song with a new coat of paint, I am curious how I can possibly make it up for you and if I could come on the show in the future to redeem myself. I mean, that would be the only way you could make it up to me is to come on and actually sing a new song. So perhaps... We bring back Suicide House. We bring back Comedy Fang Fang. Yeah, Next year, well, there I'm is a new, not, not sure a new Halloween that, episode. Are you saying right now we are announcing that we can... I, I don't quite know is that that's going to happen. Okay. <laughs> Wait, we're dreaming again, oh. right? Welcome to the dreamscape. <laughs> Leo Carpazzi, your images surround you. Everything you sang about is around you. Oh, God. The images you summed up. <laughs> The headless horseman getting head and all that stuff. This is my perverse. hair is so white. Swamp thing for some reason is part of the pantheon of monsters. Swamp thing. <laughs> yes, the it's most classic of the universe. Of I think he is a monster. Swamp I think thing. he qualifies as a monster. That's I mean, my the argument. The creature from the Black Lagoon included. would be much more normal. Fit that into a lyric. There's a lot of syllables, Jason. <laughs> They're all attacking you. Oh, God. The monsters, yes, oh. and they come. They're all horny, and they're coming from all. They're attacking me. Oh, they're filling my holes. Oh, this is my worst nightmare. He will fuck you. Yeah, he's into it. Wait, he's into it. He likes it too much. Let's wake up. Let's wake up. Oh. Guys, I didn't go into that dream. I was out here in the real world. <laughs> what were we all doing? You guys were asleep, and Kapazzi was going through your wallets. <laughs> what? You weren't asleep? It's been a grift all along, baby. Oh, damn. A long you say, baby, you say baby, too? <laughs> I say baby, yes. All right, look, we're wow. running out of Raise time. Raise your hand if you say we, baby as part we of We all do. We all have Bibles. God damn it. We just have one last thing to do on the show. That's a little something called plugs. <laughs> Let's hear that one more time. (laughs) No, thank you. That was Plug Ivan by Kofau. By Imogene Heap. (laughs) Um, All right, guys, real quickly, go around the room. You want to plug anything? What do you got? Anyone? 
<laughs> oh boy! You just plug given up. up. I want to plug up his of course. Yes. And I also want to plug um, Raceway TV and Freedom. Right. Podcast. Thing. Spontaneous Asia. Sure. Why not? Don't give no, I'm that. saying we'll throw it in. Well, you rolled your eyes. I'm not trying well, to fight you, right? Stop fighting, guys. <laughs> it's oh just my a God. prelude. We just love to fight. <laughs> oh, my God. Gina, what do you want to plug? Uh, this amazing podcast I listen to uh, with three white male hosts called Action Boys <laughs> with a Z. Actionboys.biz. They're white, cis, hetero men talking about <laughs> movies. It's the only place to get an opinion like that. <laughs> uh, Jason, what do you want to plug? I'll plug uh, The Long Dumb Road, which is available now on uh, demand or on I- Apple, iTunes, all the places but you go. We watch it. It already made a billion dollars. Listen, watch it, rent it. In fact, buy it. If you buy it off of iTunes, you get you unlock the scene in which I show my full dick. Oh, oh wow! Sick. <laughs> Rudimentary North. Hey, uh, Scott. I do want to plug the show called uh, Rectal TBS. I'm a writer on it, and um, <laughs> you are Rudy. <laughs> yeah, I guess Rudy gotta, North is a TV yeah, writer. Yeah, yeah. You got to fill your time. Somehow. It's pretty easy to that's punch also, a, that's a also TV canon. writer in the yeah, throat. Yeah, yeah, that's yeah. canon. That's right. also canon. Um, and I did want to say, Scott, a Jewish I, television you writer. <laughs> you you wouldn't believe it, Scott. <laughs> also, why are you wheeling a cannon in here? <laughs> well, that's I need something to point out when I say that's canon. <laughs> um, also, I do want to say that um, I do have a message from the future, Scott. You should not end the podcast. Something terrible will happen. Oh, okay. Well. well. Mm-hmm. I wasn't really close to it. Okay, okay. All right, great. Okay, cool, cool. Uh, John Lennon, what do you want to plug? Oh, I've got a big 2019 coming up. <laughs> <laughs> okay, we'll look out for it. Yeah, check it out. <laughs> In about uh, two weeks or That's so. That's right. All More right, questions great. for Lennon coming up. Uh, Danis and Danias? Oh, we're looking for... Four million dollars oh, for five percent equity. You've gone down. You've gone down from four billion. I remember. <laughs> well, it's been a, it's been a while. We're it trying is, to redeem. We've been, been a while. Many offers. It's we been. <laughs> and uh, let's see. Over here we have. Uh, uh, kill him! I'll kill babysit him. your kid. Um, <laughs> God, that's so weird. What? It's not. I just want to make some money. Oh, stop harshing my work ethic. <laughs> <laughs> And uh, Peter Classic Griffin. kid slang. Uh, yeah, hi here, Peter Griffin from Family Guy. Uh, I would like to plug A Star is Born, starring Lady Gaga and Bradley Cooper. It is a great movie. It inspired me to be a dramatic actor. Leo Caprazzi, what do you want to plug? Uh, you can check out Doughboys, the podcast about chain restaurants. Very, uh, that, that, that comes I heard out those Thursdays. guys killed each other. Uh, well, that was <laughs> fingers crossed. That was in a dream. Um, and also, uh, my my granddaughter's uh, Scaroline, her murder was a cold case. So if you have any tips, uh, <laughs> okay, contact yeah. the Senate. Like a cold case. So that- she was murdered, but you also feel that she's definitely in hell. And yes. also, it was a cold case, so it's not cold anymore. It's, it remains a cold case. Okay. Okay. That that cold case? It. it is a cold case. Uh, I want to plug. Uh, there's Wait, a- Morpheus, the Dream Lord. We're not in a dream. Uh, you're all asleep, I- and oh. I would um, like to plug. A podcast I've only heard about in people's dreams. Screw it. We're just going to talk about the Beatles. Uh, What do people dream about it? What do you think it's about? I think it's about uh, what if Peter Tork and Marsha Brady uh, was on the TV show Webster. (laughs) Sounds about right. I think I know how old Morpheus is now. (laughs) Check it out and then dream. Check it out and then... Totally relevant. Yeah. Good dig, old man. <laughs> uh, now I think you're waking up. Oh, 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 oh. Beth, anything you want to plug? Beth? Yo! <laughs> ah, just myself for the nice list. Bye, baby. All right, I'm going to plug uh, Freedom. Of course, the aforementioned Freedom, and we have a new episode of Are You Talking to R.E.M. Me out this weekend, or this week, rather, this Wednesday. Listen to it. All right, let's close up for the last time ever for this song on the show. Let's close up the old plug bag. Thank fucking God. Oh, what a bag. It's time to open it. It's time. I'm going to miss that one. Pres- Nobody is going to miss Preston, that one. <laughs> Preston Easter or Preston Preston Easter? I can't remember. He did the remix of that. Uh, he shouldn't have. 
<laughs> R.I.P. That song. Yeah, a year to memorize his name. R.I.P. Big Dog. R.I.P. Scaroline. Guys, Big I Dog w- T-shirts available on the Earwolf store. <laughs> of course, covered Big dog with catchphrases dog. <laughs> and blood. Um, guys, I want to thank covered you with all. Covered catchphrases and blood. Please design that shirt. All right, that it's looks like big, it's covered in blood. The, the exact catchphrases, the ones on the arm. That's the ca- right. Big Dog. Just covered in blood. Covered in blood spatter. All right, we might. Guys, I want to thank you all uh, for being here. It means a lot to me that y'all came by, and I want to thank everyone for listening to the show it means a lot to me that you all listen every week we have the best ofs coming up next week paul f tompkins and i counting down your top uh i want to say 12 or 14 episodes of the year we'll see you next week thanks bye and record (laughs) hi everyone thanks for listening and remember meet sonos beam the smart compact soundbar for your tv beam lets you fill the room with the rich sounds of everything you love, from music and radio to movies, TV, podcasts, and more. All of this on Sonos, especially during the holidays, you're going to want to listen to all your favorite Christmas records, watch all of your favorite Christmas movies. Go to Sonos.com to learn more and order your Sonos Beam to start your smart home sound system. Hi, I'm Paul F. Tompkins. My podcast, Spontanean Nation, is wrapping up at episode 200, and that final show will drop on Monday, January 21st. We'll have one of our favorite guests in for an interview and an extra-long improv set featuring an expanded lineup of Spontanean Nation all-stars. Whether you've been a fan from day one or you've never even heard the show before, I hope you'll listen to this very special episode. Happy New Year!